хэлбэрүүдэг үр байна. Тэгэхээр бурхнаас өгөгдсөн зөвлөдөг авч амьдрах цаг лугаа шилдсэн байна. Бид нар олон удаа бодож ирсэн. Юу хэрэгтэй байдг юм. Бурхан таамд амьдрч байгаа хүн одоо нэг амьдрсан шиг амьдрмаар байна ч гэдэг юм. Зөндөө олон үйл бүрүүд байдаг. Би танд хэлээ. Өнөөдрийн өгсүүдэг сонсч байгаа хүн нэг бүрт үйлд хийсэн болгон чинь таних өөрийнх чинь байх болно гэсэн үг. Та айх хэрэггүй. Ямар ч үйлд хийхдээ та айх хэрэггүй. Яагаад бол та зөв ойлголттой байгаа учраас амьдрал улам илүү тод болж байна гэсэн үг. Бидний амьдрал дээр бурхан одоо та бидний хүсэл гэдгээс илүү зүйлүүд өгөх хүсэж чинь штэ. Тэгээ бид нар мэддэг бурхан надад хамгийн сайн сайхны өгөх хүсдгээ гэж. Тэгээд авал та аваа чи одоо тэгээ та над бид нар нэг зүйлийг бурхан мэдүүлж байгаа зүйл нь юу вэ гэвэл авахын тул та авах савтай баймаар байна. Бүр цэвэрлээ төгцөн дээр савнд нь хийгээд авчмаар байна штэ. Тэгээд хог ногшин дээр нөгөө шин юм аа бол бүр баллаа тэгээ. Тэгэхээр зөв ингэмэргүй байгаад байгаа. Тэгэхээр энэ өдөр бас бурхан хэлэгч байгаа зүйлүүд олон илүү бидний оюун бодолд үлдээсээ гэж бодож байна. Та нар маш олон зүйлүүд бодож байгаа байх. Маш олон зүйлүүдийг асуултыг тавьж байгаа байх. Тэгээ тэр болгон чи бурхан хариулах болно. Та бэлэн байгаа юу? Халлелуя. Хамтдаа залбирцгаа. Халлелуя. Таны юу болсон зүйл сэтлээ бид танд таалахгүй гэж байна. Бурхан та өнгөө бид нөгөө зүйлүүд зааж өгөх болтго. Ариус үс та бид нь олон өдрө оронцоод нээж өгөх болтго бидний. Бид өнгөөр өөрсдөө нэг хэдэж байна л гоо байна. Өөрсдөө чадвар дотор найд маргүй байна. Уу таны өгсөн бэлэг авьяас бид найд маргүй байна аа. Би нү таны гайгаа биш дээрч бид анхаардаа тань маргүй байна. Хар нь энэ өртөн зүг бүтээс эзэн тань. Эцэг тань өөрсдийн хийж байгаа ажлууд дотор чинь бид нар хандрагч нь байж өө залуу шилжин байж бид амьд өнгөрч чинь аа. Энэ өдөр та бос бид олон зүйлүүд нээж өгөөч. Би таны өмнө тосоо хүмүүсийг магтаад өөрөө
us even before we knew you. Thank you because you drew us, drew us by your spirit. And, and we met your son Jesus Christ whom you have sent to us whom you have sent to us and because of what he did we could be reconciled with you, Father. No condemnation, no blame, no guilt. No shame. We could become children of God. What a privilege. Thank you, Father. We love you, Father. We thank you, Jesus. Jesus, stand by Holy Spirit, we want to follow you. The Aaron soon stand by Lead us. Instruct us. Guide us. Energize us. Energize us. Equip us. Circumcise us when it's necessary. So God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we thank you and praise you. Amen. Amen. You may be seated. Even we don't understand everything about the Trinity, we believe in a triune God. Yeah. Yeah. This is not a course of theology. But God is three in one, we know that. Even we don't understand it in details. We believe in it. You know, you don't, you don't need to understand everything to believe in it. We don't understand Wi-Fi. Some of us, we don't understand Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. But if you, you don't understand it, you know how to use it. And it works most of the time. Yeah. So we believe in God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And they are one, even they are three persons. I don't struggle with that. You should not. Yeah. You know, how can that be? Three in one? One third, one third, one third. One third, one third, one third. Equals one. one. <laughs> I'm a math teacher, it does not even provoke me. It's okay. <laughs> because even, in the, even in the world of math, there are strange things. I 
I will not talk about that. За тэрний талаар яах вэ? If you if you see for example sport. За ямар нэгэн спорт үзэж илэ гэж бодох. You have these boats, long thin boats with you know eight people inside of them. Тэгээ нөгөө тийм гүйлтийн зам дээр гүйл биш үү? А сэлүрддэг нөгөө завин дээр юм 8 хүн цуврд суугаад Maybe there are eight. Two nine. In one boat. Nick seven there. And when they cross the finishing line, who won? Tin. Everybody won. Тэгээ нөгөө гараа барин дээр ирэхээр хин ялах уу? Бүгд ялах байхгүй юу? There were seven or eight or 12, you know, some of them are very long. 7, 8, 12 байсан ч хамаагүй. But they work like one man. Яг нэг хүн шиг ажилдаг. And they do well. Тэгээд маш сайн ажилдаг. If they didn't do well, they will go like this. Тэг хэрвээ тэд нар буруу ажиллаад тавил ингээд 2 3 тийш. They know exactly when to hit the water, when to leave the water. Тэд нар яг хизээ сэлүүрээ усан хийхгүй хизээ авах уу гэдэг айгүй сайн мэддэг. So the eight men became one man. 8 хүн яг нэг хүн шиг ажиллаж байгаа. For me that's explanation enough. I don't need more. Энэ бол л яг тайлбар нь мөн байхгүй юу? Энтэй удаа марах хэрэггүй. My wife and I we are one. Ихнэр бит хоёр нэг юм. We are not one half and one half. We are one and one, and it's still one. Ni hoyer ni ni hoyer ni ni bish ni ki ma hapitoyer. That's my theology. In that mini theology. Keep it simple. Ingi betsa. And uh, so we believe in God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. Ye borchan itzak borchan ku borchan erunsus. We love the Father. Bitner itzak thayrte. And we we must understand what the Father does. Itzke yu hisnik bitner ayatra khirte. How the Father speaks. Эцэг хэрхэн бидэнтэй ярддагийг ойлгох хэрэгтэй. But you know how the son speaks and works. Мөн хүү хэрхэн ярддаг ажилтгийг бид нар ойлгох хэрэгтэй. We must know the Holy Spirit very well. Бид нар ариун сүнсийг маш сайн мэдэх хэрэгтэй. All right. First Timothy chapter 6 verse 20. За нэгдүгээр Тимот 6:20. Okay. First Timothy chapter 6 verse 20. Paul wrote to his spiritual son Timothy. Paul өөрийн цөнслөг хүү болох Тимотод бичиж байна. O Timothy. O Timoto. God the deposit entrusted to you. Хачамд хариуцуусныг хамгаал. Avoid the irreverent babble and contradiction of what is falsely called knowledge for by professing it some have swerved from the faith. Дими хоосон үг яранаас хийгээд мэдлэг гэж хуурамчаар нэрлэгдсэн зүйлийн эсэргүүцлийн номлолоос зайлсах юм. So we have to guard the inheritance. Тэгээ бид нар нөгөө өвийг Timothy received something from God. Timot we got he was a believer. Тэгэхээр Timot бурхнаас ирсэн өвийг хүлээж авсан. Amen. Came from heaven. Тэгээ тэнг тэнгэрлэг улсаас ирсэн. He also received certain things from his mother and grandmother. Тэгээ бид нар бас нөгөө ийм ээ ээж биш ээ. А мөн Тимот дээрээс хүлээж авсан, ээжээсээ хүлээж авсан, мөн имээгээсээ хүлээж авсан. He was privileged. Тэгээ тэр үнэхээр адстай байсан. Family members who are believers. Тэгээ нөгөө гэр бүлийнх нь гишүүд нь бүгд итгэгч нар байсан байхгүй. Not everybody has that. Тэгээ хүн болгонд тийм байхгүй тий. For some of you maybe you are the first believer in your in the whole family. Зарим та нарын зарим нь гэрийнхаа хамгийн ихний итгэгч бас байгаа тийм хүмүүс зөндөө байгаа. Be happy. Тэгээ та баяртай бай. Consider it an honor, not a problem. Тийм энэ бол асуудал юм шиг харин өөнийг хүндэл. Oh, if I had Christian parents and Christian grandparents. Оо манай ээж аваа ер Христ чинь байсан болоосаа гэл. I know people who have Christian parents and Christian grandparents and Christian grand grandparents and grand 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 grandparents and they're not doing very well. Тэгээ би зарим Христ чинь мэднэ эцэг их имээ илэн цоланцэн бүгд Христ чинь хэрнэ айгүй муу байдаг тийм хүмүүс юм. So if you are the first one in the family be proud of it. Тийм тэгэхээр гэр бүлдээ анхдагч нь бол үүнийгээ үнэл үүндээ талрах. Yeah, you are the beginner. Ягаад гэвэл та эхлэгч юм а. Of a new family inside the family. Тийм. Гэр бүл дотрох шин гэр бүл. And have your next generation following you. Тэгээ таны араас ирж байгаа үеийнх нь таныг дагаг. So he had God in heaven. Тийм. Тимотод Тимотын тухай ярьж байна. Тимотод тэнгэрлэг эцэг байсан. He had his mother, grandmother. Amen. Ээж нь байсан. Certain things came that way to him. Тийм. 
бас түүн рүү имээ ээжсэн дамжуулж түүс ирчихсэн. And he had Paul as a spiritual father. Мөн Павл сүнсний эцгэн байсан. And something came from him also. Тэгээд түүнээс бас юм сэрсэн. So there are different rivers flowing together. Тимотро маш олон одоо амийн гол урсаж ирсэн. It should not be a problem. Тэг энэ бол асуудал биш. I said it should not be a problem. Тэг энэ бол асуудал биш. So Paul said to Timothy, guard the deposit entrusted to you. Then he said a second thing. Avoid the irreverent babble and contradictions. Тэгэд хоёрт нь болохоор дэмий хоосон үг яринаас хийгээд мэдлэг гэж хуурамчаар нэрлэгдсэн зүйлсийг эсэргүүц гэсэн. Sometimes to God what is given to us. Заримдаа бурхны бидэнд өгсөн тэдгээр зүйлс. We will have to avoid certain things. Is it me or is it you or both okay so god what you have been entrusted and avoid certain things i believe paul is wise he knew what he was doing he knew what he was saying Тэр юу хийж байгаагаа мэддэг байсан ам юу хэлэхээ бас мэддэг байсан. He didn't throw up words. He Тэр... thought about what he said and put it down. Тэр зүгээр үгсийг чулууддаг нэгэн байгаагүй юу хэлэхээ үргэлж бодоод бичээд тэгээ ярьдаг байсан. When you have something valuable. Танд ямар нэгэн маш үнтэй үн цэнтэй зүйл байх юм бол Something precious to you. Тэр үнхээр үнтэй зүйл юм бол таны хувьд. In order to guard it. Хамгаалах хэрэгтэй тий. Yeah. You will have to avoid certain things. Тийм ягаад гэвэл төвөр тэр зүйлээ хамгаалах нь тулд за зарим нэг зүйлээс зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. I'm a married man. Би бол гэрэлсэн хүн. If you want if I want to guard it. Хэрвээ би энийг хамгаалах нь тулд. Guard my marriage healthy. Гэр бүлээ гэрэлтэй ариунаар одоо эрүүлээр хамгаалж үлдэх нь тулд. Би зарим нэг зүйлээс зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. Are you me? Тийм биз те. If you want to have an education. Хэрвээ та боловсрал эзэмсгийг хүсэж байгаа бол сургуульд явлаа You will have to avoid certain things. Бас нь зарим нэг зүйлсээс зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. That's the price to get it. Энэ бол тэр зүйлийг авахд таны төлж байгаа төлбөр. And that's the price to guard it. Тийм тэр бол тэрийг хамгаалахд зарцуулагдчих байгаа төлбөр. Amen. Even if you're not married, you still have to avoid certain things. Та гэрлээгүй байсан ч гэсэн зарим зүйлсээс зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. Because maybe somebody wants to marry you somebody you don't want to marry. Тийм зарим та нөгөө таны гэрлэгч байгаа хүн чинь таны гэрлэхийг хүсгүй байгаа нэгэн бэж болно шүү дээ. Right? So even if you're not married. За гэрлээгүй байсан ч гэсэн. Maybe somebody wants to marry you. За хин нэгэн чамтай гэрлэхийг хүсжээ. And if you don't want to marry him, you must avoid him. Хэрвээ та тэр хүнтэй гэрлэхийг хүсгүй ах юм бол та зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. Look him deep in the eyes and say no. Нүдрүү нь маш гүн харж агаад үгүй гэх хэл гэсэн. Yeah. I mean recently I was in somewhere. Sri Lanka. Би саяхан Sri Lanka-д байсан. And I was coming down from with the lift. Аха. Цахилгаан шатар бууж байла. And there was a woman in the lift. Тэгсэн цахилгаан шатан дотор нэг эмэгтэй байсан. Тэр эмэгтэй ингэж хэлсэн. Do you need a woman? Тэнд эмэгтэй хүн хэрэгтэй юу гэс? I said no, I have one. Гэхдээ надад нэг байгаа гэж. You know. If you want to guard certain things, you have to avoid certain things. Та ямар нэг зүйлсийг хамгаалах нь тул зарим нэг зүйлсээс зайлсгийн хэрэгтэй. That's life. Энд чи амьдрал шүү дээ. You want to do sport? Хэрвээ та спорт хэрэгжилхийг хүсчихэв. And be good at sport. Амжилт гаргахыг хүсчихэв. You have to avoid certain food. Зарим нэг хоолыг идэж болохгүй. If you feed on McDonald's you will look like a burger. Тийм McDonald's тэр банк яваад тавил бургер шиг бол шүү дээ. Yeah there is a price to God certain things. Тийм зарим зүйлсийг хамгаалахын тулд төлбөр хэрэгтэй. Amen. Amen. This is what Paul wrote about. Яг үүний талаар Павл бичсэн юм. God what has been given to you God the inheritance. Тийм бурхан чамд хариуцуулж өгсөн тэр өвийг хамгаалаа гэж. In order to guard it you have to avoid certain things. Хамгаалахын тулд зарим нэг зүйлсээс зайлсах юм. Аха. Because you can be deviated. Yeah, but you will see. No, That's why we tell people in in our people connected with us. Don't listen to all the Christian speakers in the whole world. Stop doing. 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 Stop do
It does not mean it's forbidden to hear anybody else. It just means somebody has to be the primary one. And the rest is secondary. I'm married. Okay. So I don't have to marry another one because I'm already married. But it does not mean that I cannot talk with women the rest of my life. One is the primary, the rest is totally different category. So we tell our people very open, very frankly. If, if you are connected here, this is the primary connection. We say the same to our children. This is home. Yeah, but neighbors' children, they have nice toys. Better toys than we. Oh, the, the food they are making in there. Yeah, but that's secondary. Home is home. You can, you can play with the toys, but then you come home. You can eat the food, but then you come home. <laughs> are you with me? Somehow we are just all over the place. Listen to that one, listen to that one. That's the best way to be confused. We should not do that. Something must be primary. You can have Good friends, but your parents are still your parents. And when we are teenagers, we might dream about other parents than the one we had. But later we realize they were good. They were not perfect, but they were exactly what I needed to have. perfect, but they were exactly what I to have. You can have many teachers, but you don't have many fathers. So I can read other Bible teachers' books, no problem. I can attend a conference here or a conference there, but home is home. So Paul is very open here with this spiritual song. I'm very, I pay very much attention to confusion. And I, have, I think I have told you many times, that's the thing I fear the most. Sin is sin. We know how to cope with it. Confusion, confusion is difficult to cope with because it's confused. That's the problem with confusion. It's confused. That's why that's the thing I fear the most. I hate to be confused. It's so good to be clear. It's fantastic to move from confusion to clarity. Amen. It's such a wonderful experience. I was unclear, now I see it clearly. It's like cleaning your glasses. Oh. Yes. Oh, re yeah. revival. <laughs> I, I can see everybody. Amen. So confusion, be careful with confusion. And our experience tells us that Christians who listen to 15, 20, 30 preachers, they are confused. Because so many voices. There must be a primary voice. Of course, the primary voice is the voice of the Father. But there must also be a primary voice on earth. The voice you trust, people you know. They are clean. 
they have integrity. Тэн маш их нөгөө consistent, they are stable. Amen. Тууштай байдал байдаг. They say what they mean, they mean what they say. Тэн тэд нэр юу хэлж байгаагаа мэддэг, хэлж байгаа үг нь юу юу вэ гэдэг бас мэддэг. People like that are valuable. Ийм хүмүүс л үнэхээр үнцэнтэй хүмүүс юм аа. So I have a primary voice in my life and I have some secondary voices. Надад гол үнцэн дуу хаалаа гэж байдаг, а бас хоёр дахь дуу хаалаанд гэж бас байна. First of all, I have the voice of the Father. Хамгийн нэгдүгээрт миний эцгийн дуу хаалаа юм аа. Men shall not live by bread alone, but by every word proceeding from the mouth of the Father. Хүн бол бурхны амнаас гарах үг нэг бүрээр амьдардаг. So we are speaking about legacy. За бид нэр өвийн талаар ярьж байгаа. And I told you I gave you the five what up. The sense the main five components in the legacy. Өв дотор байгаа үндсэн таван надад байгаа төлхөрийг бүрсэн. Insight. Тэ энэ бол гүн ойлголт нэг бол assignment. Даалгавар хоёр дугаарт. The resources. Их сурвалжууд. The lineage. Удам угса. And influence. Нөлөө. And the day before yesterday we looked at the bit about we looked into the insight. Урчигдэр бид нэр нөгөө гүн ойлголтын талаар ярьсан. And as I said to you that was a little bit of a surprise or not a little bit quite a big surprise for me. Энэ бол нөгөө гинтийн бэлэг байла тий. Because I heard all my Christian life. Яагаад гэвэл би бүх христийн амьдралынхаа туршид. That the most important thing is to love God. Хамгийн чухал зүйл нь бурхныг хайрлах юм аа гэж ойлгож. The rest means nothing. Харин бусд нь юуч биш гэж бодчихсан. But I have to come to a place where I found out this is not the whole truth. Тэгээ би нэг мөрчөд ирээд энэ бол бүх үнэн биш юм аа гэдгийг ойлгосон. Part of the truth. Энэ бол үнний хэсэг нь байсан. So so I've heard so many times. Let's not talk doctrine. Let's not talk understanding the scriptures. Because that separates us. Тэ нөө нэг сургаал номлол те доктрин онлыг сонсоод тахар энэ биднийг тэр үгнээс салгадаг. And I can still see on Facebook many posts are saying the same. Тэн тэр Facebook дээр тавьсан постуудыг харахаар ихэнх нь forget what we disagree about and focus on what we agree about. Let's forget. Forget what we disagree about. Аха. And let's agree about what we agree about. Тэн бид нар нөөс санал нэгдэхгүй байгаа зүйл яа мартцгаа. Харин санал нийлж байгаа зүйл дээр төвлөрцгөө гэсэн тийм комментууд айгуух байсан. That sounds very good. Энэ бол үнэхээр сайн. But it's not the whole truth. Тэгтээ үнэн бүтэн үнэн бол биш. It's not the whole truth. Бүтэн үнэн бол биш. Just not the whole truth. Бүтэн үнэн бол биш. Because it is the truth. Мэдээж үнэн. Then if you look at the whole Christianity. Харин бүх христийн ертөнцийг харах юм бол what we all can agree about. Бидний бүгд хүн санаа нэгдэг хэсэг бол маш баг байхгүй юу? Jesus is the son of God and the cross and the Bible even the Bible don't touch the Bible. That's a dangerous place. Jesus бол бурхны хүү, загалмаа гэж Библи гэмгүй та. За Библи дээр ч гэсэн юу нэ асуудалтай. Even when we speak about Jesus on the cross we might mean different things. Тийм бид нар Есүсийг загалмаа дээр цовдсон тэр зүйлийг ярихад л бид нар маш өөр олон янзаар бодсон байх боломжтой. I'm not saying we have to discuss theology. Тэ энэ дээр зөв теологийн одоо тийм маргаан тийм мэдрэлтэй явуулъя гэсэн дээр. Insight is very important. Харин гүн ойлголт бол үнэхээр чухал юм аа. Very important. Бүр маш чухал. I know it can be the source of discussions and disagreement. Мэдээж хүмүүс санал нэгдэн нэгдэхгүй ийм мэтгэлцээнүүд явуулж болно. Би мэд pastor for 40 years. Би 40 жилийн турш pastor байгаа. Once I even was part of a committee of theologians. Тийм би бүр нөгөө нэг теологийн онлын одоо холбоо юу тий комити зөвлөлт байсан. Lutherans, Baptists, Salvation Army, Methodists, all kind of people. Тийм Baptist нөгөө нэг аврлын зар тарахчд тий ингээд юм олон урсгалын. We agreed about very few things. Тэгтээ бид нар маш баг зүй хэдхэн зүйл дээр санаа нэгддэг бас. And then we couldn't talk about anything else. Тэгээд тэгэхээр ч өөр бусад зүйлийн талаар ярих боломжгүй болчих. No we didn't agree. we didn't even agree about the most basic. Бүр хамгийн basic хамгийн суурь юм дээрээ бид нар ингээ юм дээрээ санаа нэгддэг бас. Тэгээд хоорондоо ярилаа. One man was there he was a professor in theology. За нэг теологийн багш байсан тэр бол. Listen to me. Oh Philip, now I understand. You are the type of person who believes in the resurrection. Тэгсэн дээр хүн оо Филип би таныг ойлголо. Та нөгөө дахин амжилтанд итгэдэг тийм төрлийн хүн юм байна гэж хэлсэн. 
Like if, like if I was an idiot or something like that. Yak bi nik mangar khun bai sim shi. Yeah, I am the type of person believing in the resurrection. Tim bi dakhi amjilta ditik de tim turli khun bai na gich. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Ah bi yak tanik tim gich batsi ma gich nugu khun. These people, you know. What can I talk with them about? How can we work together? We can work together. So inside is very important. 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 Үйлс хоэр? Акс 2, верс 16-22. Израилин ерчүүдэй эдгээр үлсэг сонсадсхоо. Мэнэн, нау а вэл гэв юү инсайд ин сотэн ишиүүс. Гэдгэн, яг одоо би таанарт зарим нэг зүйлсэн гүн мэд Because if you if you had known that, here we have only met some person, but you you had not crucified him. To only have to go back with him. Because you did not know it was the Messiah. Then to only Messiah get to turn and meet again with us. You kill him. That turn and to only ask. So he said, now listen. Here not a chance to talk. This Jesus of Nazareth, a man attested to you by God. But when Nazareth Jesus said that, you know. Тай бурхан Назарын Есүсэр дамжуулан таанарын дууд хүчд үйлс гайхамшиг тэмдгүүдийг бүтээж. With mighty works and wonders and signs that God did through him in your midst as you know. Гайхамшиг тэмдгүүдийг бүтээж энэ хүнийг таанарт үзүүлсэн. This Jesus in Jesus you crucified. In Jesusыг таанар цовдолсон юм аа. And killed by the hands of the lawless men. Бурхангүй хүмүүсийн гараар түүнийг цавдлуулсан. Verse 24. God raised him up. Гэтэл бурхан үхлийн цавлан эцэс болгаж. Verse 32. Урчан 2. This Jesus God raised up and of, of that we all are witnesses. Энэ Есүсийг бурхан амлуулсан бүгэд бид бүгдэрүй үүнийг гэрш нар муу. Verse 36. Урчан 2. Let all the house of Israel therefore know for certain. Тиймээс бурхан таанарын цовдолсон тэр Есүсийг Do you hear? No for certain. No for certain. Do you have that in Mongolian? You don't have that. А, баттай мэдэгтэй. Okay. Let all the house of Israel therefore know for certain. Израилийн бүх гэрүүд үүнийг сонсогтой. Which means the house of Israel must know these things. Израилийн гэр тийм үү? Яг энийг мэдэх ёстой гэж байгаа. That God has made him both Lord and Christ, this Jesus whom you crucified. The Borchni, that's it. Borchan Tanrin Tavtlsen Tiri Jesusik, itzem bas Christ batlsnik Israelin ayl bukhun batta mitiktong. So what did he do? He gave them insight. Kitgen yuxu wakir Tir i Peter titnt kung ayrlti kuchang. They made the biggest mistake in their whole life. In watlot. Бүх амдарлий ха туршид тэрсан хамагийн том алтаа байс. So he gave them understanding of what happened exactly. Яг юу болсан бай гэдгийг тэднэрт ойлг улсан. This man was sent by God. Тэр Есүсэг бурхан элгээс. God did miracles through him. Түүгээр дамжилд бурхан гайхам шүдэг бүтээсэн. He's the one you were waiting for for centuries. Таанар түүний хитн зуны турш хүлээж эсэн тэр нэгэн чин бэс. You kill him. Харин түүнийг алсан. Killed, Харин таанарын алсан тэр нэгнийг бурхан дахин амжилсан юм аа. Then the next verse says. Харин дараагийн ишлэлтэй. When they heard these words. Тэд эдгээр үгсийг сонсоод. Do you have that? Mhm. Mm What is it? 37. Now when they heard this. 37. They were cut to the heart. Сонсон зүйл нь тэдний зүрхийг хүндсэнд гэж байгаа. They had No, they went from no insight to insight. Тэд нэр ойлголтгүй байснаас гүн ойлголт руу шилжиж байгаа. And then we Christians say, oh, it's not important, just love God. Тэ харин христийн бид нар юу гэдэг вэ гэхээр энийг ойлгох юм хөстгөө зүгээр бүхнийг хайрлаа. We can love God and and commit the biggest mistakes in our whole life. 
бид нэр бурхныг хайрласан хэвээрээ маш том алдаануудыг хийж болно амьдралдаа. I mean the Jews have been loving God since the days of Abraham. Харин Абрахамын үеэс эхлээд юудаачууд бурхныг хайрладаг байсан. They loved him, they honored him. Түүнийг хүндэлдэг байсан, хайрладаг байсан. Түүнд үйлчилдэг байсан. They were around the tabernacle, then around the, te- the temple. Тийм, тэд тэр нөгөөний тахлын ширээний тий хажууд байдаг байс байдаг байсан тэд тэр сүмд байдаг байсан. They had Samuel, they had Moses, they had Joshua, they had David. Тэд гайхалтай сүнслэг эцгүүттэй байсан Joshua, Samuel. They had awesome prophets Jeremiah, Ezekiel. Тэн Ezekiel, Jeremiah гэд маш гайхалтай иш үзүүлэгч нар тэдэнд байсан. Haggai, Zechariah. Haggai, Zechariah гэд. When Haggai and Zechariah prophesied, they got courage. Тэг Хагай Захарая нар иш үзүүлэхэд тэд нар урам зэргийг олж ирсэн. They knew all that. They were familiar with that. Тэг тэд нар эднийг бүгдийг мэддэг байсан. They have been God's people since Mount Sinai. Тэг тэгээ бурхны хүмүүс Синай уул руу явахад So they loved him. Синай уулаас хойш бурхныг мэддэг байсан арт юм. They knew him. They loved him. Тэд нар түүнийг мэддэг байсан, хайрладаг байсан, хүндэлдэг байсан. Yes, they from time to time they sin. Yeah. Тэн заримдаа үе үе тэд нэр том том гимүүд хийдэг байсан. Гэхдээ зүгээр And even they were not faithful. God was faithful. Тэн тэд нэр итгэмжгүй байсан ч бурхан бол итгэмжтэй байсан. God does not regret his call. Тэ яагаад гэвэл бурхан өөрийнхөө дуудлагыг буцааж авахгүй маа. Even you are not faithful. God is still faithful. Та итгэмжгүй байсан ч бурхан итгэмжд хэвээрээ байгаа. Even you make mistake as a as a child of God, God is still your father. Та бурхны хүү гээд алдаа гаргасан ч гэсэн бурхан таны эцэг хэвээрэл байгаа. We don't send our children into the street because they lie or they steal from my pocket money or whatever. Бид нар хүүхдүүдээ миний карманаас мөнгө авсан асуул худлаа ярьсныхын төлөө гудамжинд хөөж гаргадаг шүү дээ. You don't have to teach children to steal. They find out themselves. Тийм. Та та өөрөө бүр хулгай ихийг зааж өгөөг байхад хүүхдүүд олоод мэдсэн. They know where the money is. Тийм мөнг хаана байгааг мэддэг. They know where the chocolate is. Тийм шоколад хаана байгааг мэддэг. Even we say no chocolate today. They know where the chocolate is. Өнөөдөр шоколад байхгүй гэсэн ч хаана байгааг мэддэг. Do you remember we had four, you know? Тийм бид нар нөө дөрөв үхэдтэй. We saw chocolate on the table in the kitchen. Тийм. Тэгээд галзуухны ширэн дээр шоколад тавиад. So we go then. Тэгээд дуудаад. Where does that chocolate come from? Ин ханас гараад байна. Just rest, small rest. А ин жижигэн шоколадны үүр мөнгөнүүд чирэн дээр басан гинэ. Тэгээд дуудаад ин одоо ханас гараад байна. The main thing had disappeared. Тийм гол нь том эсгүүд нь алгуулгад үүр мөнгөнд үлдсэн байгаа хөхгүй. They were not well trained yet in that. Тэрийг нөө харай чадваргүй байсан байхгүй тэд нар. They were still practicing. Тийм тий яг их хичээлж байсан. What is that chocolate? We don't know. Тийм ин ин шоколад хайч өгс ч мэдэхгүй. So okay. За за. So then we the chocolate was up there in the kitchen. And the chocolat нь болохоор гал зуухны төр дээр байсан. And we thought how can it get up there? За тийш яаж хүрсэн болоо гэ бодсон чи. And we put the drawers. Тэгсэн чи нэм нөм юу шургуулгод тийм. And we saw that inside the drawers there were chocolate all the way up. Тийм тэгсэн чи шургуулгодод тэр онгойлгод ингээд жижигэн чокладууд ингээд үлдсэн. So they used the drawers as a lift, you know, as a Яг өгсөн шат олгож ашигласан байгаа хэвхэн. So we call them. Then we knew. Тэгээ яаж авсны мэдсэн. Who ate the chocolate? Хин чоколад эцсэн бэ гэж асуус. Don't know. Don't know. Хич мэдэхгүй. Just beginners. Just beginners. Эхлэгчэд байсан багхгүй тий. Анхаар шатны сургачд. First grade in lying. Just first grade. Худлаа ярих нь нэгдүгээр анги. Not advanced lying. We don't know. Аксан төвшөн төвш тий. So one by one. Нэг нэгээр. Did you eat chocolate? No, no. Чи чоколад эцсэн үү? Second one. No, no. Хоёртан дээр нөгөө. Буруутгах нь үгүй. Fourth one. No, no. Дөрөвтгэх нь үгүй. First one again. Дахиад нэгдгээс нэгэлж байна. After three times. Гурван удаа ингэж явсны эцэс. Did you eat the chocolate? No. Чи эцсэн үү? Second one. No. Хоёртхан идэг. Then the third there is always a weak link. Тэд нар дунд нэг юм баг юу лээ сул дараа нэг юм байгаад байгаа хөхгүй аль нэг газар нь In every team every бүх багд хин нэг нь заавал сул дараа байдаг. And that was the third one the youngest of the three boys. Тийм. Хамгийн баг хүүнд буюу гуравтхан. Did you take the chocolate? Чи шоколад авсан уу гэсэн чи? No. Үгүй. I was watching at the door. Би хаалган дээр мана ч хийж исэн. And the eyes of the others. Нөгөөдөөдийнхаа нүдэн ингээд пөлбатлал нөгөөдөө. I mean 
It's a challenge to have children, but it's also fun from time to time. We could not punish them. It was impossible. We just laughed, they laughed, and they were safe. That one time, they were safe. Next time. Okay. Are, you, are you understanding what I'm saying? So, we can do mistakes, but we're still children of God. But it does not mean that we can go through our whole Christian life and stay ignorant. It does not mean. God, God is my father, I'm a child of God, so it's not important. Peter gave them insight. The 3,000 who got saved devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching. Why? Because they knew insight is important. I know we need more than understanding. We need action, we need change, we need, but we need understanding. Right. So, is insight important? Yes, it is. I also mentioned that one verse yesterday, no, the day before, that Paul said to Timothy, you have followed me in my doctrine. First element. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You, however, have followed my teaching. Yeah. Second Timothy 3.10. You can put in your notes. Oh, you don't have to leave. Mm. Don't leave. Okay. We read that the day before yesterday. Now, tonight, I want to give you some of the elements of this understanding. What are the main things? The Holy Spirit will guide us to all truth. But there are certain truths which are primary truths. Okay? And when I ask God, God, which one should I mention when I instruct people? Five came to me. And I'm sure God, God can add more. That's just five very important ones I have found out. Both from searching the scriptures, from our own walk with him, because certain things you learn by walking. Not by sitting on your bottom and just hear it. You have to walk the walk. Walk the talk. And then you understand, aha, this is the way it works. Oh, aha, this is the way it, it does not work. <laughs> and then you search the scriptures to find out how does that work. So we learn through walking as well. But let me give you five main issues which are absolutely important, essential. If we don't understand these five main things, we are still children of God. Because are we born again? We're born again. But we will live a confused life. A weak life. We will lack some resources from time to time. We will become vulnerable. So storms might deviate us too easily. And we might enter heaven alone, without next generation. So, let me give you these five things. Number one. 
I call it the centrality of the heart. The centrality of the heart. The heart is the center. It's the core of our person. Yeah. And I know this, most Christians know that on a certain level. But I believe there is more to it than we think. That's why Solomon said to his next generation, Guard your heart more than anything else. Anything else means anything else. And Solomon knew what he talked about. Number one, he grew up in a family where David was the father. And if you read about the family of David, it was not paradise on earth. Serious issues. Sexual immorality. Serious sexual immorality. Murder. It was really, really a family with a lot of storms and issues. Solomon, Solomon grew up in that family. Absalom rebelled against his father. And, and had sex with his father's wife. To attack his father, to challenge his father, provoke his father. Solomon grew up in that family. Quite dysfunctional, even David was a man after God's heart. So when Solomon talks to his next generation, said to him, guard your heart more than anything. And, and we have to listen to that. Even we Christians, we have been hearing about the heart for hundreds of years. Oh, oh, this, oh he has such a good heart. What do you mean by that? Oh, he's in all the meetings. <laughs> and? He gets does not mean anything. It can mean something. But it does not need to mean anything. It does not need to mean anything. Yeah. Huh? For some it means something because they are here because they have the right heart. Uh -huh. People can be in all meetings because they are dead. You know, they just come automatically. <laughs> it's like in a cymetery. These people are there all the time. <laughs> come next week, they're still there. <laughs> in the tomb. <laughs> they don't move around, they're still <laughs> there, the same place. So we. I believe God will show us more and more about the heart. You know the problem God had with the nation of Israel. It was not sin because sin can be fixed. All the time you, your heart deviates. All the time. You work for a while and then you. And then you work for a while. All the time. So God is like, how can I use these people? How can I entrust them with assignments? At one, there is one situation, I don't remember where it is, Nehemiah, I think. Where, God's, where the, God challenged them to take a decision. And, and then God said to them, God said to the prophet, to Nehemiah, somebody. And he took a coat, he took a coat. A coat. And God said, 
If you change your mind. Тэг хэрвээ чи бодлоо өрчлөх юм бол one more time. Ядаж нэг удаа. This is what I will do with you. Энэ би чамд үүнийг би чамд хийж өгнө. Тэгэд нөө нэг цамцнаас нь аваад ингэж сэгсрээ. To and the message was don't change your mind all the time. гэдэг нь юу гэсэн үг санаа байсан бэ гэхээр битгий байн санаа оюун бодлоо өөрчлөө гэсэн өөрийн оюун бодлоо бий болго making up your mind might take a certain time to make up your mind оюун бодлоо зэгцлэг үед might take a certain time цаг хугацаа чарна but when you have made up your mind хэрвээ та оюун бодлоо зэгцэлчих юм болов stick to that Тэгэл түүнд тэгээд зурлт. If you want to marry, don't marry after one week. Take your time. Тэг хэрвээ та гэрлэгч байгаа бол нэг 7 хоногийн дараа битий гэрэл. Сайн бод. But when you know, you know. Go for it. Тэг хэрвээ та мэдчих байгаа бол тэгээ гэрэл. Is that? That's wisdom. Энэ чинь мэрэгэн ухаан юм аа. Are This is the same. Тэг. The heart all the time. There is a problem with the heart. Тэг зүрхтэй нь асуудал байсан. Тэдний зүрх байнг гажжсэн. The second problem God had with them is they had a stiff neck. Хоёр дахь асуудал нь юу байсан бэ? Тэд нь хөршөө хөдөлтэй байсан. It was difficult to move them. Тэдний хөдлөг гэд маш хэцүү байсан. Do you do, have you tried to have a stiff neck? Хөршөө хөдөлтэй байж үзсэн үү? It's not easy, you know. Okay. Хэцүү штэ ингээд. Хөш хөдөөгөө эргүүлж чадахгүй ингээд бүхэл бие ирээ. Үнэхээр аимшигтай. I hate that. Но гоёддаг штэ те монголоор бол. So God said two problems with you Israel. Тэ та нарт ийм хоёр асуудал байна гэж бодох байсан. Таны зүрх болон хүзүү. You know sometimes it's the same with us. Тэ заримдаа бид нар ч гэсэн яг адилхан болчих. So the heart is central. Тэ зүрх бол гол төвн юм аа. David was a man after God's heart. David бол бурхны зүрхийн араас үнэхээр мөшигдөг нэг юм байсан. He was sweet or nice or friendly. He was. Тэр бол үнэхээр сайн хүн байсан те. But to have the heart of God it does not mean to be nice and friendly and sweet all the time is to have the heart of God. Тэг бурхны зүрхийг мөшгөн гэдэгт байнга тийм сайн байж сайхан байж чадахгүй одоо байнга л одоо нөхөрсөг сайхан аштай байж чадахгүй. And for David the heart was central. Давидад зүрх нь гол цөмн байсан. Let me show you this. Are you still with me? За та ойлгож байна уу? First Chronicle шастрын дэд шастэд шастрын дэд first chronicles дэд verse 28 which one one first chronicles uh, chapter 28 sorry ah. chapter 28 verse 9 28 verse 9 yes Oh maybe before that let me see. First Chronicle 28 let's start verse 2. 28 2 оос эхлээ. That's at the end of the life of David. Давидын амьдралын сүүлийн хэсэг байна. And in verse 2 the Bible says, Then King David rose to his feet and said, Hear me, my brothers and my people. Тэгээд Давид хаан хөл дээрээ босон миний ахтуус болон миний ард түмэн намаг сонсогдсон. I had it in my heart. to build a house of rest for the ark of the covenant. Би эзний гэрэний авдар болон бидний бурхны хөлийн тавиран зөриулан байнгын өргөө барихыг хүссэн юм аа. I know we know this expression what we have on our hearts. Тэг бид нар we have this expression as well as Christians. To have something on our heart. Тэг зүрхэнд ямар нэг юм байна гэдгийг би. Oh, I this on my heart. И тэг Pastor Sura I have this on my heart. Тийм бид нар данда тэгж ярддаг. Энэ зүйл миний зүрхэнд байна аа гэж ярддаг. Next Sunday I will bring sandwiches for, to the whole church. Тийм дараагийн 7 хоногт би юу яана? It's not something you have. Сэндвич авчирна сүм дээр гэд. It's a thought you had. Тийм энэ чин зүрхэнд байгаа зүйл биш байхгүй. Энэ чин таны бодол. And it's a good thought. Энэ сайн бодол байна. Especially if the sandwich is free, ne? Тийм тэгэд өнөгөө сэндвич авчирч байгаа бол бүр сайн. Everybody will be happy. Whoa. Тийм бүх хүмүүс л баярлалаа шүү дээ. Free sandwich for everybody. Цоглааны дараа бүх хүн өнөгөө сэндвич идэх. But we are you know we are 
сүм дээр болохоор тэ бид нэр сүмээр сургагдж байгаа сүмд байгаа гэдэг утгаараа бүх зүйл л энэ миний зүрхэнд байна гэж ойлгох. Гос ава ма хаа ту хелп with cleaning the floor. No, it's just миний зүрхэнд энэ шалыг цэвэрлэх юу байна гэж. Don't make it a hard thing when it's not a hard thing. Тийм бол зүрхний биш зүйлийг битгий зүрхнийх болгооч ээ. Otherwise everything is a hard thing and then nothing is a hard thing. За тийм бол бүх юм зүрхнийх болоод заримдаа бүх юм зүрхнийх биш болчихно. Yeah. Keep the words for the right purpose. Тэн үгсийг зөв зорилгын төлөө ашигла. So when David said I had in my heart to build a house for the for the the ark of the covenant. Тэ гэрээний дагуу бурханд зориулсан барилгыг би барих хүсэл миний зүрхэнд байсан юм а гэж тэ. Not like bringing sandwich or you know cleaning the toilets or you know. Тэ нойл цэвэрлэх өнөгөө сэндвич авчрахтай юм хамаа. Stop saying things like that. Ингэж битгий яриа чи. Because it devaluates the words. Энд үгийг бүр үнд цэнэгөө болгож байгаа байхгүй юу? I have my heart to go to church. Shut up, go to church. Period. Надад зүр сүмрүү явах зүрх байна гэдэг. Энд чинь зүгээр ама архиад хамхиад сүмрүү яв. You know, don't use heart all the time. Тэн зүрхийг үргэлж битгий ашигла. We do that to legitimize what we are thinking. Бидний бодож байгаа гоогүй болох тий. Зөвтгөх бодож байгаагаа зөвтгөх нэг муха арга юм тий. It's like when people say, "Oh, I don't like that." Then, there are things that really don't like. The bin don't hear torgoi. You know what? We don't have to like everything. Then, bitner buch yaman torgoi. Ta torgoi wat bi inen torgoi tega hilite. Paul said Timothy avoid certain things. Then Paul Timothy zerem nek zu se zes hiks. But I was raised in a good Christian family. Then un bi wat lo un ker sang Christian ger bu tes tarsa. But we have to like everything, love everybody. Then buch yaman torta buch kune khair tat. Be a doormat for everybody. Тэ бүх хүмүүст ингээд нөө юу болохоо тэ. Гутлын ингэж хүрэн нь болол. And don't do anything if your heart is not in it. Don't do anything. Хэрвээ таны зүрх чинь хөдлөхгүй бол битгий бүх юм их. I do a lot of things without my heart in it. Тэ миний зүрх ороогүй маш олон зүйлийг би хийжсэн. A lot of things. Маш их зүйлийг. Yeah, but David was man of the good heart. Тийм, харин Давид бол бурхны зүрхийг мөчтөй нэгэн байсан. Stop being the Bible. We have a Bible already. Тийм. Библ битгий, дахиж битгий Библ бай. Яагаадгүй л Библ үржээ бид нарт бай. If we speak the language of the Bible, we are Тийм. You know. бид нар Библийн үгийг ашиглаад ярьж байвал те бодох хэрэгтэй. When I step into the flight from here to Beijing, you know, I don't have that in my heart. It's my flight ticket. Би Бэйжингээс Улаанбаатар дээр онгоцоор нисэж ирлээ гэсэн. Энэ миний зүрхэнд байхгүй байхгүй. Би онгоцны билет авлаа тэгээ ирлээ. Period. Тэгэл болоо. I almost missed my flight in Copenhagen. I mean. Тийм нөгөө Copenhagen нөгөө I was running around and you know buying juice. Гүүж агаад нөгөө жуус идэр авч уучаад онгоцноос хоцорцсон. So I look at the monitor. Gate closed. Тэгээд харсан чинь хаалах хаагдсан байна гэдэг. Гинт гүүж агаад харсан чинь I run like I never run before. Тэ би урд нь гүүж байгаа гурэ гүүсэн. I didn't run with all my heart. I ran with both legs. Би бүх зүрхээр гүүгээ гоохгүй зүгээр л би тийм шиг хар хурдаараа гүүсэн. So be careful not to overuse Bible words. Тийм. Библийн үгийг хитрүүлэн битгий ашигласан. David had this fire in his heart. Харин Давидд түүний зүрх Давидын зүрх нь дим гал байсан. You know the ark had already killed somebody. The ark. Ah, ah, no. After, after the Lord came to save us. Somebody touched the ark and fell off dead. Then, so the Lord got the third Gazra and saved us. So it was serious. Then, she knew her not to touch. So David was such a man. David was on her third knee. Okay, you with me? So he said, "I had it." How was that? Three, two. I had it in my heart. Then David, in what many churches have said, "My God." But then, verse three, God said to me. You may not build a house for my name. Тэгээ 3 дугаар ажил гэвч бурхан надад чи дайн ч хүм ба цус ургасан тул миний нэр алдарт зориулсан сүм барьж болохгүй. Let's go to verse 9. За 8. Now he speaks to Solomon his son. Yes. Тэгээд одоо тэр Соломонд ингэж хэлжээ. Because David should not build the temple but Solomon should build the temple. Давид барьж болохгүй гэсэн учраас одоо Соломон барих хэрэгтэй. Now hear the words of David. Энд Давид хүүдээ ингэж хэлчихэ. And you Solomon my son know the God of your father. Миний хүү Солмоно өөрийн эцгийн бурхныг танд мэдэн. 
which means there is an inheritance. гэж хэлж байгаа нь тэнд нэг өв байна гэдэг хэлж байна. This project is not a one generation project. Энэ project энэ төслөн зөвхөн нэг үеийнхны төлөө биш юм аа. It it went all the way from Abraham all the way to you. Тэ Абрахамас өгсүүлээд одоо ингээ чамар руу ирж байна. And now Solomon you are the one. Одоо Соломон чи тэр нэг өвийг хүлээж авах нэг юм байна. Okay. So know the God of your father. Эцгийнхээ бурхныг танд мэдээ гэсэн. And serve him with a whole heart. Бүх зүрх болон оюу ухаанаараа and with a willing and a w- with a willing mind. Тэ оюу ухаанаараа түүнд үйлчлэхтэй. For the Lord searches all hearts. Учир нь эзэн бүх зүрхүүдийг шалгадаг. And understands every plan and every thought. Бодол санааны хандлаг бүрийг мэддэг юм аа гэж. This is serious talk. Энэ бат үнэхээр чухал яриа байна. So what is it David does? He gives him insight. This is the way you have to work with. Энд Давид хүүдээ гүн ойлголтыг өгч. Энэ яг ингэж явт юм аа гэд. Don't work with God the way you want. Work with God the way he wants. Бурхантай битгий өөрийн арга замаар алах харин түүний хүсэж байгаа арга замаар алах. So with all your heart. Тэ өөрийн бүх зүрхээрээ and with your mind. Оюун бодлоор. Heart and mind. Зүрх сэтгэл болон оюун бодол. Both have to work together. Энэ хоёр яг зэрэг ажиллах хэвээр. Amen because God searches the heart. Яагаад бол бурхан зүрхийг нэгждэг. And understand and hear the thoughts of the mind. Тэ оюун бодлыг ойлгодог, мэддэг. But the first thing is the heart. Хамгийн нэгдүгээрт зүрх. So David was a man after God's heart and he told Solomon you must be a man after God's heart. David өөрөө бурхны зүрхийг мөшгдөг нэг юм байсан. Тэгээ хүүдээ чи бурхны зүрхийг мөшгөх хэвээр гэж. Okay. Did you hear that? Mm-hmm. Now. Let's go to the next chapter. За дараагийн бүлэгт дээр. Chapter 29. 29. Where do we start? Mm-hmm. Verse 17. Arundala. I know my God that you taste the heart. O borkham and ta khuni zurhig tandam idich. And have pleasure in uprightness. Tig shulum baidlig taalan sairghtag. In the uprightness of my heart I have freely offered all these things. Bi nigent mitdig uchir. Bi chin үнэнч зүрхээрээ эдгээр бүх зүйлсийг сайн дураараа өргөсөн юм. And now I have seen your people who are present here offering freely and joyously to you. Тиймээс одоо энд байгаа таны ард түмэн танд сайн дураараа өргөлүүдээ өргөж байгааг би хараад баярлаж байна. O Lord God of Abraham, Isaac and Israel. Бидний эцэг өвгөд болох Авраам, Исаак, Израилийн бурхан эзэн. O fathers. Бидний эцэг Keep forever such purposes and thoughts in the hearts of your people. Өөрийн ард түмний зүрх сэтгэлийг үүр диймээр нь хадгалан тэдний сэтгэлийг the hearts toward you. Өөр тэдний сэтгэлийг өөр руугаа хандуулаач. Can you hear the word which is repeated all the time? Та энд олон давтагдж байгаа тэр үгийг сонсож чадчих нь. The heart the heart the heart the heart everywhere. Зүрх 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 гэж хаасайгүй. So God David is conscious. I have did my best after what I had what God had put in my heart. David мэдчихсэн бурхны өөрийнх нь зүрхэнд хийсэн зүйлсийг. Solomon have the same heart. Хаан Соломон яг тийм зүрх байсан. He said God give all the people the same heart. Бу нэг зүрхтэй тэдгээр хүмүүсийг гэсэн үү тий? Yeah. Одоо бүх хүмүүс хэлж байна. Та нар ч гэсэн тийм зүрхтэй байг гэж хэлж байна. You with me? Keep Forever such purposes and thoughts in the hearts of your people. Тий. Өөрийнхөө хүмүүсийн зүрхийг яг тэгж хадгалаач ээ гэдэг чинь. Amen. So David, Solomon, the whole nation. David. One heart. David, Solomon, тэгээ бүх үндэст нь нэг зүрхтэй. Okay. Verse 19. 19. Grant to Solomon my son a whole heart. Миний хүү Соломон бүрэн төгс зүрх сэтгэлийг өгч Why is the heart so important? Яга зүрх ийм чухал юм бэ? Because when the heart is right, everything becomes simple. Зүрх зүв байх үед бүх зүйл ингийн байх болно. David knew when the heart goes wrong, everything goes wrong. David зүрх буруу байх юм бол бүх зүйл буруу байх гэдэг мэдчихсэн. Absalom was the son of David. 
Absalom бол Давидын хүү байсан. The Bible says Харин Библ дээр because of certain things which happen in their family. Тэр гэр бүлд болж ирсэн зарим нэг зүйлийг улмаас Absalom was mad at his father. Absalom was mad. Ааа, та маш их урлсан. Was angry with his father. Тэ эцэгтэй маш их урлсан. And he decided I will the Bible says he stole the hearts of David's people. Тэ тэр Давидын хүмүүсийн зүрхийг хулгайлж ирсэн, тэ? Yeah. And David had to leave Jerusalem crying. Тэгээд Давид Иерусалимыг уйлаад орхих хэрэгтэй болсон. And people wish were shouting at him. Тэ хүмүүс түүн рүү хашгалж ирсэн. Some people were throwing stones at him. Түүн рүү бүр чулуу шидэж байсан зэрэг. David had to leave the place. Why? Because of a conflict in his own family. Тэ ягаад Давид орхиж явах болсон бэ гэхээр гэрт нь үнэхээр надтай асуудалтай байсан. When the hard day anything can happen. Disasters. Тэ зүрх гажих үед бүх зүйл бүр гамшиг болж хөвлөж. David knew that. David үүнийг мэдчихсэн. He knew that. Therefore he said, God, please. Тэгээд бурхан мэнэ та надад туслаа чи. Give my son such a heart. Миний хүүд энэ зүрхийг өгөө чи. Give the whole people such a heart. Бүх үндэстэнд бүх хүмүүс энэ зүрхийг өгөө чи. Solomon have such a heart. Solomon тэр зүрхийг өгөө чи. Otherwise, хэрвээ үгүй бол they will be unable to work together. Хамтдаа алхах боломжгүй юм аа. They had to have the same heart. Тэг тийм болохоор тэд нэг зүрхтэй байх хэвээр байна. Is that possible? Энэ боломжтой юу? Yes it is. Тийм ээ үнэхээр боломжтой. 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 What he said about the first generation of believers they were one heart. Тийм эхний үеийн итгэгчд тэд нарт нэг зүрхтэй байсан. But there is a process to be to come to that place. Харин тэр зүрхтэй болохын тулд тэр процессор хурж байгаа. Харин бурхан бидний зүрхтэй ажилтдаг. Because the heart of man is deceitful. Яагаад гэвэл хүний зүрх бол хуурамч үү? That's why we have to from time to time go through circumcision of the heart. Тийм болохоор бид нэр үе үе зүрхний хөвч хөндөлтөр ордог. Amen. We can disagree. Yeah, we can disagree. Бид нар санаа нэлэхгүй байж болно. My wife and I we can disagree. Их нар бид нар үртэл санаа нэлэхгүй байдаг. But we have one heart. Гэхдээ бид нар нэг зүрхтэй. Disagreement is not a problem when the heart is well tuned. Тийм. Таны зүрх чин нэг байх юм бол санаа нэгдэхгүй байх нь асуудал биш. Now if you remember Solomon. Хэрвээ та Соломоныг мэддэг бол. Questions what was the characteristic of Solomon? Соломоны яг зан чанар юу вэ? Шинч чанар тий? Яг юу вэ гэдэг. Most Christians would say. Тодорхойлт нь юу вэ гэж хайдаг. Wisdom. Тэр бол нэгдүгээр хүмүүс мэргэн ухаан гэдэг. Not true. Энэ бол үнэн биш. I thought that for. Ти би ч гэсэн тэгж бодчихсан. 30 plus years. Ти 30 гарн жилийн турш. Yeah, but Solomon prayed God give me wisdom. He didn't pray give me wisdom. Соломон бурхан мэнэ та над мэргэн ухааныг өгөөч гэж залбирч ирсэн. This is our problem. Энэ ч юм бидний асуудал. We don't pay attention when we read the Bible. Бид нар Библийг уншихдаа үнэхээр анхаарсан. That's why we lack understanding. Ти юм болохоор бид нарт ойлголт үнэхээр байхгүй. Бид нарт гүн ойлголт бүр байхгүй. And we are missing some very important elements. Ти бид нар үнэхээр хамгийн чухал тэр элементийг орхигдуулж байна. I'm not judgmental now. I just say what it is. Би та идэг шүүж байгаа биш. Зүгээр ийм л байна. That's a problem. Энэ бол бид нэрээ асуудал. My people go wild, go wrongly because of lack of knowledge. The Bible says. Тийм миний хүмүүс буруу явдаг нь мэдлэггүй юм болбас юм аа гэж Библ дээр бичсэн байна. Let me show you, show you the Solomon. Тийм за Соломоныг. The Solomon story. Соломоны төрхийг үзэл. Second Chronicles chapter 1. Шаштрын дэд нэгдүгээр бэлэг. For you who still think Solomon prayed for wisdom. Соломоныг мэргэн ухааныг гуйж залбирж исэн гэж бодчихсон. Тэр хүмүүс Энэ бол тэр асууж исэн тэгтээ энэ бол бүх үнэн биш. Okay. Look at chapter 1 verse 11. 11-р ишлэл. God answered Solomon. Бурхан Соломонд ингэж хариулж байна. Because this was in your heart. Итгэр зүйлс чиний зүрхэнд байсны улмаас. And you have not asked for possessions, wealth, honor or life. Чи ид баялаг хөрөнгөцөр алдар хүнд. You have that? Аха. Uh-huh. So, what did Solomon ask for? Соломон яг юу гоож залбирсан юм бэ? He asked for wisdom. Тэр мэргэн ухааныг гойсон. But wisdom where? Тэр мэргэн ухааныг хаана. In the heart. Зүрхэндэх мэргэн ухааныг гойсон. Solomon knew wisdom is not everything. Тэр 
Соломон мэрэгэн ухаан гэдэг нь бүх зүйл биш юм а гэдэг мэдчихсэн. Хэрвээ мэрэгэн ухаан нь одоо бузар зүрхэн дээр ирэх юм бол тэр мэрэгэн ухааныг бузраар ашиглана. Yeah, the wrong heart pollutes everything. Тийм буруу зүрх бүгдийг бүснүүлнэ. That's why Solomon asked for wisdom in his heart. He knew the heart is the main thing. Тийм болохоор Соломон мэрэгэн ухааныг зүрхэн дээр гуйсан. Ягаад гэвэл зүрх гэдэг нь хамгийн гол зүйл гэдгийг мэдчихсэн. And you know what? I don't have time to explain all that. Тэгээ би энэ бүгдийг тайлбарлах цаг баг байна. But when the queen of Sheba came. Тэгээ нөө Sheba came. The queen. Sheba гэх таан шүү дээ. She came like many kings and princes. Solomon дээр нөгөө ирж зочилдог олон хаалт from Solomon because he was such a wise. Шебагийн хатархан Солмоно суралцахаар ирдэг. So she came. Тэгэд ирээд. And she saw everything. Whoa. Тэгээ бүх зүйлийг хараад. The clothes of the servants, the food on the table. Чирэн дээр тавьсан хоол, зарц нарийн хувц гэдэг. The cutlery, the forks and knives and. Тийм. Тэгээ хутах сэрэ бүгдийг хараад. Everything was so nice everywhere. Бүх зүйл бүх газар их сайхан. She heard the wisdom. Тэгэд Соломонны нөгөө мэрэгэн ухааныг сонсоод and she was impressed. Тэгээ үнэхээр зүр да she was impressed. And she thought I've never met such a man in my whole life. Тэгээ би бүх амьдралынхаа туршид ийм хүнтэй уулзаж байсангүй гэж хэлсэн. Now I thought for many years that she was impressed by the forks and the knives and the, you know, the clothes of the servants. Тэгээ тэр хүн урд нь зөндөл зарц нарын хувц хоол халбах сэрээ харж л байсан байна. She was a rich woman. She was a queen. Мэдээж ирэх тэр чи хатан хаан байсан юм чи баян л байсан байж таа. You have a lot of silver, silver does not impress you. Тийм тэ зү одоо мөнгө халбах гэдэр бол нэг тийм гайхадах юм биш. You have 100 diamond rings, you know diamond will not impress you anymore. Тийм тэгэд 10 одоо 100 алмазсан шигтгэтэй эмэгтэй бол нэг гайхадах юм байхгүй. But she was impressed by something else. Харин тэр өөр зүйл сэтгэл нь хөдлсөн юм. The Bible says that when she saw him go up to the house of the Lord. Тий. Түүнийг нөгөө бурхны өргөө рүү өгсөж явахт нь хараад. Listen. Хараад. When she saw him go up to the house of the Lord. Бурхны өргөө рүү өгсөж явах нь хараад гэж байна. She knew there is something taking place in there. Тэ тэнд нэг юм байна гэдгийг олж харсан. That's where the source of all this is. Тэр зүйл нь энэ бүх зүйлийн их сурвалж байна гэдэг олж. That's what the Bible says. Тийм болохоор Библ дээр That she said half of the story was not told me. Түүхийн хагсан мэдэгдсэнгүй. She had heard about the riches, the wealth, the extreme wealth. Тийм тэр нөгөө эд байлгын талаар бол үнэхээр их сонсож байсан. And then she said not half of the story was told me. Тийм харин түүхийн тал нь надад мэдэгдсэнгүй надад ярьсангүй гэдэг нь юу гэсэн үг вэ гэхээр тэр эмэгтэй ойлгосон өөр нэг зүйл байгаад байна гэдэг ойлгосон энэ бүх хэд байлгийн цаана нэг юм байна тийм бол өөр төрлийн эд байлга байна соломон сонха хас плаг инту дат ривер тэг бо Соломон тэр голоос яг уулж ирсэн. And these are just the consequence of it. Харин тэр голоос уулж ирсэн нь улмаас энэ бүх зүйл үр дүн болж гарч ирсэн байна. What was the second half of the story? Тэгэхээр нөө түүхийн нөгөө тал нь юу вэ гэж асуусан. Hard relationship with God. Соломоны бурхантай харьцах зүрхний харилцаа байсан юм аа. He went up to the house of the Lord. Тэр бурхны өргөө рүү өгсөж орхоод He had fellowship with the Father. Бурхантай тийм харилцаа нандан харилцаа байсан. When she saw that the Bible says she lost her breath. Тэр бүр I've seen that. It's amazing verse. Тэр бүр хилэх үггүй болсон гэж библд дээр үүд. She was so so үнэхээр амьсгаач авч чадхаа байсан. Even her body was affected. She almost lost her breath. This is just mind blowing. Тэгээд үнэхээр стад тарих задлсан байсан тэр. What was that? Энэ яг юу вэ гэдэг. Not silver and gold. Тэр алт мөнгө байгаагүй. It was a hard relationship with the God of heaven and earth. Мөнхийн улсад байгаа бурхантай харьцаж байгаа зүрхний тэр нандан харилцаа. So Solomon was a hard person. Тэр Соломон бол үнэхээр зүрхний хүн байсан юм аа. For a while. Тийм учраас хэсэг хугацаанд хэсэг хугацаанд тэр үнэхээр зүрхний зүрхний хүн байсан. Харин дараа нь тэр нэг эмэгтэйтэй гэрлээд. Don't think it because it had many wives. Don't Тэн түүнд тийм олон их нэр байсан гэж бүгд байна. The Bible is very explicit why. Тэн. The Bible is very explicit. Аха. 
Яагаад гэдэг нь Библ дээр тодорхой харуулсан байгаа. Tells us exactly what happened. Яг юу бас нэг Библ дээр тодорхой битсэн байгаа. They took away his heart. Тэр зүрхээ эргүүлсэн гэж байгаа. And when the heart is gone. Тэ зүрх нь явцсан учраас бүх зүйл тэгэд нурсан. So everything is about the heart. Let me close this before the break. За. Proverbs chapter 2, I think it is. Сургалт өгс 2. So don't don't think any more don't say any more than Solomon was just a wise person. Тэгээ Соломон зөвхөн мэргэн нэгэн байсан гэж битгий бодоорой. He was. Тэр байсан. But the wisdom came into a very good heart. Харин мэргэн ухаан бол маш сайн зүрхэн дээр ирсэн учраас. But when this relationship these connections тэр харилцаа happened тэр бүх зүйл бий болсон юм. It stole his heart from God. Mhm. Let me find it. When I was in the house of my father, what is that? Let me find the verse. Chapter two, verse one. Some people said to me, "I read the Proverbs because there is so much wisdom there." Зарим хүмүүс надад хэлтэй сургаалт өгсөг байн гоншдаг ягаад гэвэл тэнд мэргэн ухаан байдаг гэд. Тийм ээ үнэн. Depends on where the wisdom lands. Тийм тэгээ таны мэргэн ухаан хаана газардчих вэ гэдгээ шалтгаална. It lands in a polluted heart, ambitious heart, manipulative heart. Үнэхээр буудар зүрхэн дээр үнэхээр тэр шунлалтай атгаг санаатай зүрхэн дээр ирэх юм бол use for the wrong purposes. Буруу зорилгын төлөө ашиглагдана. Okay. So chapter 2 verse 1 My son if you receive my words treasure up my commandments with you making your ear attentive to wisdom and inclining your heart to understanding Хүү минь хэрв чи миний хэлэхүй хүлэн авч миний тушаалуудыг дотроо нандигнан хадгалвал мэргэн ухаанд анхаарах чиг тавьж цээжээ тунган бодох руу хандуулдаг бол Verse 9 Then you will understand righteousness and justice and equity every good path For wisdom will come into your heart. Юс тэгвэл зөв болон шударга явдал цэг шулуун байдал ба сайн сайхан зам болгоныг чи ухаарах болно. Аха. Юу зэнэ бэ вэс ам лукинг ам сорчин ва спикс абаут хис хис фадер. When I was in my father's house. Where is that? Ицгийнхээ гэрт байхад би тэр Just give me a couple of minutes, I will find it. See someone in the beginning. Is it already in chapter four? Yeah, chapter four. Dorutgur bolik. Here now, Solomon is speaking to his son. Ata in Solomon ori ke kuth hantang inge chichi. His next generation. Ori ke taragi ngui hantang chichi. His successor. Тэр өөрийнхөө хүлэн авах үе spiritually, politically, financially. Эдийн засгийн хувьд, улс төрийн хувьд бас сүнсний хувьд хүлээж авах тэдгээр хөнгөтэй ингэж хэлсэн. He said to him, "Here, O sons, even more sons. Here, O sons, a father's instruction and be attentive that you may gain insight." Хөвгүүд минэ гэд нэг биш нилэн эдэн хөвгүүдэд хөвгүүд минэ эцгийнхээ сургамжийг сонс оюун ухаан суралцахын тулд анхааралтай байцаа. I give you good precepts do not forsake my teaching. Би та нарт эрүүл сарвал сургаалыг заадаг. Миний сургамжийг бүү орхигдвал. He come verse 3. When I was a son with my father. Гурав дээр би эцгийнхээ хүү ихийнхээ инхэрэг ганц хүн байхад speaks about David. Тэ Давидын тухай ярьж байна. Соломон talking to his sons about his father. Соломон хөвгүүдтэй өөрийнхөө эцгийн тухай. When I was a son with my father. Тэ би эцгийнхээ хүү байх та? I was tender. Тэ? I was tender. The only one in the sight of my mother. Тэ би эцгийнхээ хүү байх та? Ихийнхээ нандан he taught me. Хүү байхад тэр надад ингэ зас. He gave me understanding. He gave me insight. Тэ эцгээгээ хэлж байна те тэр надад гүн ойлголтыг өгсөн надад ойлголт ухаануудыг өгсөн байна. And he said to me let your heart hold fast my words keep my commandments and live. 
Тэгээд миний эцэг гэж өөрийг хэлээд эцэг маань надад сургаж бүх зүрх сэтгэлээр миний үгнээс зуурж аваа гэж хэлсэн. I pray that this heart issue will become central again. Тэгэхээр дахиад зүрхний эдгээр зүйлс дахиад төв болж ирж байна. I pray that we will stop overusing or abusing that word. Би эдгээр үгсийг буруу ашиглахгүй байхын төлөө залбирч байна. It's a thought, say it's a thought. Хэрвээ энэ бодол бол бодол. If it's an idea, say it's an idea. Энэ бол санаа бол санаа юм. Don't say I have it in my heart. Харин энийг зүгээр энэ миний зүрхнийх гэж бэлтгий хэлээрэй. Because if you talk like that, that word loses its value. Хэрвээ ингэжэл ярьж эхлэх юм бол энэ үг үн цэнээ алдаж эхлэх юм. Now I forgot what I had to say before. You know, I don't like when people say for example. За хүмүүс ингэж ярихад би үнэхээр дургу. When we were worshiping God, God showed me this. Бид нэр бурхныг магтаж байхад бурхан надад энийг үзүүллээ. Why do people say that? Хүмүүс яагаад ингэж хэлдэг юм бэ? I know what they say. Яагаад ингэж хэлдэг юм бэ мэднэ? Because яагаад гэвэл then somehow it has more authority because who it was under worship. Тэг энэ чинь нэг тийм эрх мэдлийн те зарим нэг эрх мэдлийн талаар яриад байгаа байхгүй юу? Яг магтаж байх үед ингэлээ гэд. Why I have never heard anybody say when I was in the car wash God spoke to me. Яагаад би Хин нэг нэгтэй би машина авгаалгаа байсан чи бурхан надад ингэж хэллээ гэж ярихгүй байгаа юм бэ? Well always this worship thing. Яагаад ингэж магтаалтай заавлах хэрэгтэй байгаа юм? God spoke to you say God showed me something. Тий зүгээр л бурхан чам руу ярьсан бол бурхан ингэж хэллээ. Don't add anything to it. Тэг тэр ярьсан л бол ярьсан тэрэн дээр нь өөр нэгэн зүйл битгий нэг. Basically I don't care if it was under the worship or under the shower or under Яагаад гэвэл надад ерөөс хамаагүй магтаалын дунд байна уу усанд орж явахд байна уу ерөөс хамаагүй What is important to me that it was God who said it. Тэгэхээр хамгийн гол нь бурхан хэлсэн гэдэг л чухал байгаа байхгүй юу? If it was loud or low or under shower under the worship under while you were drinking coffee <coughs> coffee at Starbucks who cares? Тэг яаж яах нь ерөөс хамаагүй байхгүй усанд орж явах вэ? Магтаал дээр те. If he spoke he spoke just. Тэр ярьсан л бол ярьсан ярьсан гэдэг л чухал ч те. We like to you know. Тэгэл бид нөгөө тгий чи ингээл ямар нэг юм нэмэл. Who can say anything against it? Тэ. Хин ч энэ зүйл эсрэг ярьж чадахгүй байхгүй юу? Who can say I'm not sure it was God. Хин ч Тэ бурх магтаал дунд бурхан надлаа ярилаа гэж хэлгэд хин ч гэсэн хүч наа чи бурхан байгаагүй юм биш үү гэж хэлж чадахгүй байхгүй юу? Because it came under the worship. Тэ. Гүй байсан яагаад гэвэл энэ чи магтаж явах үед над руу ярьсан байхгүй юу? Come on, be honest with me. Тэ зүгээр надтай Where are your thoughts under the worship? Чи сэтгэлээс үнэсээ бай тэ. They are not all in heaven. Тэ. Your thoughts when you worship, they are not in heaven all of them. Тэ. When you worship. Тэ. Багтчаахад бүх хүний мөв бодол мөнхий усад байдаг гэвэл үгүй. Come on, don't be don't be. Тэ бид тэ. Тэ. Don't be a saint, you know. Тэ битгий ариун байгаа ч. Be a human. Хүн л вэ. In the worship sometimes I think about my wife, my children. Тэ заримдаа нөгөө магтаал явж байгаад би их нэрийгээ бодно, өөр юм бодно. Yesterday actually we had to change the tires. Тэ. Нөгөө on the car. Тэ. Машины дугуй солих талаар бодов. And the worship I thought I hope my wife remember that. Тэрийг бодоод тэгэд нөө магтаалын туршидтай их нэр маань энийг сан санах байгаа гэдэг. I'm disappointed. We thought you were a holy man. Тийм. Тэгэнгүү та айгу сэтгэлээр унаа тэг хөөх пастор ч айгу ариун хүн гэж бодсон. Магтаалын дунд бол маш олон бодлууд орж гарна шүү дээ. Come on Mongolians be honest with me. Үнэсээ л байта. Uh, what should I eat tonight? Praise the Lord. За өнөөдөр юу идэд байц бурхныг магтай гэл. There was a movie tonight in the TV. Oh. Оо нэг орын нөгөө кино юу идэ гэл. Be normal. Зүгээр хэвийн л байц. So you know under the worship means nothing. Just say what God said. Магтаалын дунд гэдэг чинь ямар ч утгагүй байхгүй юу. God can speak to you while you see the TV news. Тийм таны Anytime he can speak to you. Бурх зурх дээр мэдээ үзэж яхад бурхан таны руу ярьж болно шүү дээ. Тийм бид. So we have to stop things like that. Бид нэр энэ бала зүйлээ болох хэрэгтэй. He spoke say what he said. Тийм тэр үнэхээр юу хэлсэн болол Don't underline it. Тэр нэг нь битгий гоё бол It's the same with using the word heart. Тийм энэ чинь яг нэг зүрхний юу л а? Зүрхийг ч битгий ингэж битгий гоё. Watch your mouth. Амаа мэдээрээ. Fast a little bit from the word. Тийм. Fast from the word. Fast. Don't use it. Ah, no. Uger, what's the word? Get your hands off. Stop using it. 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 St
Stop using it for a while. You know what I'm saying? Stop using it. And just say thought, idea. Amen. Then, then after a while, you can use it again. In a fresh way. Then everybody knows when you say heart, you really mean heart. Okay, let's have a break. Ten minutes? Because Solomon said, from the heart comes all the issues of life. That's why we have to look at it a little bit longer than the rest. When the heart is good, then wisdom can come in. Understanding can come in. Uh, anointing can come in. Power can come in. If the heart is polluted, we might be tempted to use power for ourselves. That's why I, I call this first element the centrality of the heart. Let's go to Psalm 51. I understand from the pastor that the Mongolian translation is very different. And, um, so that's why I can create problem in the translation. But I'm not saying that this translation is the holy one. <laughs> but I think it's the most common one. Okay. Psalm 51. Verse 6. Behold, you delight in truth in the inward being, and you teach me wisdom in the secret heart. Purge me with hyssop, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Let me hear joy and gladness. So you know, being cleansed by God does not make you sad and depressed and suicidal. Produces joy and gladness. Amen. Only pigs rejoice when they have been in the mud. <laughs> that was a bad one. Just forget it. <laughs> Let me hear joy and gladness. Let the bones that you have broken rejoice. Is God a bone breaker? <laughs> he's not, but he's transforming us and shaping us. Sometimes certain things have to be broken off our lives. If you ask a mason, who? A mason, mason. A building a house builder. He will tell you that some, sometimes the walls are so wrongly built, he has to pull them down and rebuild them right. You know what? The owner of the houses, they don't attack him. Why do you pull them down? If, if I don't pull it down and rebuild it right, the whole house will come down on you. So rejoice. And move into the house. Now it's safe. Verse 10, create in me a clean heart of God. Is that a good prayer? That's a powerful prayer. That's the biggest miracle in the universe. To change men's hearts. No healing can compare to that. Even we need healing. 
бидэнд идгэл хэрэгтэй ч гэсэн юм хэлэн амарийн хэрэгтэй надад хэрэгтэй танд хэрэгтэй children children in law need healing badly хүргэн бэр бүгд but the greatest miracle is the change of the heart агу өөрчлөлт хамгийн агу гайхамшиг бол энэ зүрх өөрчлөлт and david is crying out here david бүр энэний төлөө бүр хашгирж байгаа хөөх creating me clean heart of миний дотор цэвэр зүрхийг бүтээгээд өгөөч you a right spirit within me миний дотор зөв сүнсийг шинчлэх гэж which mean renew a willingness to change all the time the right spirit хара энэ юу гэсэн үг вэ үргэлж би өөрчлөгдөж байх юмсан гэсэн тэр нь халуун хүсэлтэй зүрхийг л бий болгоод сүнсийг бий болгоод гэж хэлсэн the right attitude зөв хандлагыг бий болгоод the right approach зөв одоо юмсад хандах хандлага help me to welcome to welcome any word proceeding from your mouth. Таны амнаас гарах бүх үгсийг зүгээр л тэврэл авахд одоо намайг тийм зүрхтэй болгоч. Even the word I don't like to hear. Надад сонсохоос дургуй үрмээр үг хэлсэн ч би тэр ч аммаар байна. Create such an attitude in my heart that I will welcome that word. Тэр үгийг одоо тэврж авах тийм хандлагыг миний дотор бий болгоч. Even my break one bone or two. <laughs> break. Break. А миний ясыг бүр тэр ирж байгаа үг хугалсан ч хамаагүй. But then that bone will rejoice later. Яг тэгэл тараад нь тэр яс баярлах байдгүй те. I don't know very much about surgery. Тэ би мистер Сэндлер сайн мэдгүй ч. But I've heard. Гэхдээ би сонсон. Sometimes when broken bones don't grow together rightly. Заримдаа нөө хугарсан яснууд буруу боролцдог штэ. Буруу боролцдог те. Зөв холбогдохгүйгээр. Am I right? Үжээ зөв. I check. Тэг би зүгээр шалгаж байна. They have to break it again. Тэ тэгэхээр нөө дахиад одоо хугардаг хуглах хэрэгтэй болж буруу боролцож болохоор But then that bone will rejoice. Тэгээд нөө төв болгохын тулд аа цаа цаа хуглаад дахиад нийлүүлэх юм биш. Yeah otherwise your leg will like this and like this. Тэгэхгүй бол хөлч нь ийм болох нь штэ те. Тэгээд нөө яс нь баярлах юм байна л да намаг зөв болгохлоо гэд. But then the surgeon will say we have to break your leg. Break my leg. Мисс хэлэнтэ уучлаар хуглахаа сөр арга байсангүй. I always already broke it once. Би ч нэг хугалцаж дахиж та хуглах хэрэг байсан юм уу гэ? Хэрэгтэй дэх шаардлага. Then go home with that. Тэгвэл одоо чи энэ мөлтөгөө харилтаа гэж байгаа байхгүй юу? Энэтэй хүлтэй. Can be a clown in a circus or somewhere. Тийм тэгээд одоо цирк. Renew right spirit within me. Миний дотор зөв сүнсийг шинчлээчэ. Verse 11. Cast me not away from your presence. Оршуугаса намайг битгий хөөгөөчэ. Take not your holy spirit from me. Ариун сүнсээ надаас битгий аваач. What does that mean? Это юкс уу? Is God taking the spirit away? Борхон өөрөө сүсэгт авч дэм уу? Why is David praying like that? Ягаад Давид яг ингэж залбираад байгаа юм? Because he knows. Ягаад тэгэл тэр мэдээд байна Давид. He understands certain things. Зарим нэг зүйлийг бүр ойлгоод байна шүү дээ. Things I have not understood for decades in my life. Би өөрийнхөө амьдралын хэдэн арны туршид ойлгодгоо байсан зүйлс үүд. Once I was blind, now I see. Hey, you're meeting with God. That's what you're supposed to do. Why does He say, "Cast me not away from Your presence"? Because that's the place where things happen. That's the place where good things happen. In His presence, there is fullness of joy. In His presence, He can heal us. In His presence, we can throw away. the cloak of shame and guilt and condemnation and ичгүүр буруутгал одоо ялынха хувцсуудыг тайлж хайдаг and receive new clothes of righteousness орнд зөвд байдлын шин хувцсыг авдаг өмсөх his presence he can restore our identity and self confidence түүний оршгүй дотор тэр биднүүсийг өөрөө өөртөө бат итгэлтэй байх юм бэ гэдгээ тодруулж авдаг that's why he said don't put me out тийм болохоор давид мэдээд байхгүй бити намайг энэ дэс гаргаж i want to be there би бүр энд баймаар байна because that's the place of hope that's the place of change that's the place of joyful time энэ оршгүй ч найдварын газар энэ оршгүй ч өөрчлөлтөө энэ бол баяр хөөрх энэ бол ерөөсө бүх юм байдаг газар гэж take not your holy spirit from me ариун сүнсээ надаас бүү аваач why not ягаад because he's the holy spirit which creates the change ягаад л ариун сүнс ч өөрөө өөрчлөлтийг бий болгодог нэгэн байхгүй юу is shaping us forming us битнийг хэлбэржүүлж одоо өөрчлөж байдаг бурхан ярддаг and his words are spirit and life түүний үг нь амба сүнс амбит so when he speaks spirit comes тэгэхээр life comes бурхан ярахад ариун сүнс орж ирж байдаг ам орж ирж байдаг амгу өхмөл өхтлүүд нь амилж байдаг what is sick becomes healthy э өвчтэй байсан бол тэр нь эрүүл болж гарч ирж байдаг Sick emotions become healthy emotions. Бидний өвчтэй сэтгэл хөдлөлтүүд эрүүл болдог. Some people are depressed all the time. Some people are 
joyful all the time. It's too much. Depressed. Some people are unstable in their emotional life. Healthy emotions. When there is reason for sadness, it's okay to be sad. It's not okay to be joyful. If you break your leg or don't rejoice, cry. It's okay with me. Something is wrong if you rejoice. You know, we heard that. We heard that 30 years ago. We, we learned that we have to thank God for everything. Wrong. 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 What about people in Syria? Do they have to thank God for a sad and chemical weapons? It's nonsense. Children in, it, in Syria or Iraq, I, don't remember. I saw that two days ago. Children were playing with the heads of decapitated people, playing football with the heads. Oh, thank God. Are you sick? We have to thank God under everything, not because of everything, not for everything. So sometimes it's okay to be sad, it's right to be sad. The day I lose my wife or she loses me, it's not time to rejoice, it's time to grieve and really grieve. Rejoice that I'm gone home or she's gone home. And God can give peace that, that uh, how is it? Peace that uh, passes understanding. Then we can rejoice. But there is a time for grief. It's not a time to dance for joy. Or grief. grief is okay. When Lazarus died, Jesus cried. He didn't say hallelujah, let's have a hallelujah. No, no, he cried. That's my friend. I will go there and I will resurrect him. Yeah. So don't take the Holy Spirit from me. Because he's the agent of change. Amen. Fantastic. Are you hearing this about the heart? Oh, the heart. Get ready. God will speak more about the heart. He wants to cleanse our hearts more. Because the Bible says the heart of man is deceitful. Even even today, as much as you have walked with God and understand God, there will, be, there will be moments where you will be shocked about what is still in your heart. You will be shocked. I don't say that to you know, sadden you. To make you sad. I don't say that Then it's hopeless. I thought I was a strong believer. believer. The kingdom house, the city church in The heart is a complicated thing. But God has not given up. That's why Jesus died on the cross. Give us a new heart. And restore our heart. Fill our heart with the Holy Spirit. That's why David said, don't take the Holy Spirit from me. Otherwise, this process will just plateau. Okay. 
So get be prepared for that. Don't don't, зүгээр... don't worry. Oh. Sana bitte zau zuer bilen bald gechile. What will happen tomorrow? Will he break my bone or? Aha, margas tiu alto kotas tiu. No, just him and how to hold him. He's your shepherd. He's your father. Afchente tani hanchen tun ditkus neta zuer taim be. Don't try to identify what is wrong. Let the spirit do that. Tere tiu me boro zuin tatrkhach kich bitte yar. Arunsus histe tiri chende. I still remember the days where you know. I will not tell you what organization is that Christian organization. Uh, once a week, people had to sit in, on a chair in the middle of the room and think back what they had done wrong. Oh my goodness. This is not okay. Jesus, Jesus never said that. Yeah, sit on a chair. Oh, oh. Did, I, did I say a word wrongly? Or oh, the right word but with the wrong attitude? Was my heart totally clean when I said that to him? You can go on for hours and days. No, that's the job of the Holy Spirit. At the right time, he will tell you. Then be quick. something. I mean, if you walk with God, if you say something wrong, or with the wrong attitude. I can tell you, you know immediately. You just know. Ding dong, that was wrong. Wake up. Then be quick, not, you know. Think back, yeah, but you know. The, the whole day went wrong. Shut up and just fix the problem. Somebody heard it, take it back. Talk to the person. I didn't mean that. Amen. Spirit is so quick. Why so quick? So we can live in freedom. And joy and a good conscience. So you don't have to sit on the chair and think back. Oh, September was very bad. October was worse. I, I hope November will be better. <laughs> December must be the, the peak of the year. Then January collapse. No. It's, it's not okay. That's, that's why we heard. That's what we did. Because we want to do it. But that's a lack of insight and understanding. Okay. Do we get this? So let God work and speak and, and, and let Him renew in you the right spirit, the right attitude. I mentioned for you in several seminars, don't be too sensitive. Because sometimes Christian is just too sensitive. At work, the boss can say to them, oh, that was not okay, do that better next week. We don't have a problem with that if we do that in church. Whoa. At school, you know, this essay. Not I mean, we don't cry for hours when we hear that. We just, we just, we just add it. What is not good enough? This, this, this. I go home and look at it and change it. In church, you say, that was not good. Not good. I'm a child of God. That's why I told you. Because you're a child of God. I'm a child of God too. That's why I told you. So much sensitivity. You know? Okay, can we leave the heart? Leave the heart. Don't leave the heart, but you know.
Achieve the heart. Number two, the key okay. the issue the where the insight is very important. The kingdom and the covenant. Both I, Pastor Pastor Bagi, have spoken about that. So, I don't want to go into that. Just to underline, it is very important. More important than we think. That's why Jesus said, Seek ye first. That's the first lesson he gave them. Actually, the first thing he did with his disciples was to give them insight. First thing. He woke up the hill. He sat down. They came to him. And he spoke. And gave them understanding. You have heard, but I say unto you. You have heard, but I say unto you. Amen. First thing he did was to understand. But he said, seek ye first the kingdom of God. That's why we have to have our focus on that all the time. I said to my leaders recently at the leadership meeting, I said to them, I have disciplined myself and I have practiced this. I have developed this habit now. Every time there is a spiritual issue, not small issues, but important issues, I take three steps back. Think kingdom and then look at the issue. I said again, again, I take three steps, some steps back, think kingdom, 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 okay. Let's look at the issue now. Because if we don't do that, we have so many traditions of thoughts. And we just take something, do something, and, and, and most of us have been so programmed in Christian, usual Christianity. But we must come back to the kingdom foundation. Everything has its root in the kingdom. I didn't say that. He said that. Seek ye first the kingdom. And everything else. Everything else is not just food and clothes and roof over your head. Everything is everything. So if we want to understand what is church, Two step back, thinking the What is Sunday morning meeting? Thinking down. Aha, this is what we have to do Sunday morning. I exercise myself because I've been programmed as an unusual Christian. Leadership in the church. How do we have leadership in the church? Stop, 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 stop. 
two step back. But it's not like you're going to be a bitch, 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 a Steve Jobs. That is Steve Jobs. That's what I'm talking about. This and that. And management thinking. Management thinking. No. Drop all that. The in-book is all. Hi. Even some of it. 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 Би нэр ингэ сурах хэвээр. So I do that all the time. I told them. Би одоо бүр ингэж баян хийж байгаа. Би бүр өдөрдөг шиг таа хэлсэн. What should we do? What should we do in this situation? Тэр та нар надаас одоо энэ тохиолдол бид нэр яах вэ гэж асуу л. It's not small issues detail. It's bigger issues. Би нөө жижиг жижиг сажиг асуудал яриаг байна. Томоохон томоохон юмнууд. Let me think come back to you. Тэгээ би та нар түгэ тэр үед чи хэлээ шүү. Би жоохон бодоотох я. Kingdom patterns. Тэгээ би дараад нь хэлээ я. Then, in the light of the kingdom, this is the solution. Тэгээд тэгэхээр хаанчлын зарчмуу одоо энэ бүх ойлголтын гэрэлд доторч нь наад яриад байгаа асуудал чи яа тусч байна гэдэг чи би хэлнэ гэж. Тэгэхээр би ямар болгоомжтой байх хэрэгтэй байна вэ? With people. Хүмүүстэй. Do you want to know why? Яагаад болгоомжлох гэж мэдэх вэ? Би та нар зүгээр л үннээсээ хэлье. Can you ask with you? Үннээрээ хэлж болох уу би? Элэн далангүй хэлье гэсэн үг. People хүмүүс live in their job, five days a week, for eight to ten hours. Хүмүүс ажилда тавун өдөр явдаг, өдөрт одоо хэдэн цагч үйдгий, найман цаг ажилдаг. Some work, sixty hours, seventy hours. Зарвин арун зорган цаг, адоо тэ, арун долон цаг ажилдаг ян зүрээр. The church member, one of our leaders, he works seventy hours. Мана өдөрчлэн багийн нэг залуу гадыр ол аймар алон цаг ар ажилдаг. People are living in this environment. Тэ, хүмүүс жи яг тэр нөхцөл байд дотар эндэрч хоу. For let's say 40-50 hours a week. Долон оног дүчуэс тайвэн цаг ажилна гэсэн. I speak one hour Sunday morning. Харин би бүтэн сайдар нэгэл цаг тэдэн дээрдэг. What do you think will happen? Which mindset will... Айл талтан байсан сэдгэлгээ хүчтээ байхуу та бодто би нэг цаг ержин тэр хүмүүс дүчуэс тайвэн цаг тэнд байна. It's an unfair battle. Бэхээ энэ чин бол үнэндээ хүч тэн цүргүү тулаан баг охгүй. I have to plant into them in one hour. Ганцхан цагийн дотор би тэдний дотор. Something which is much higher than what they are exposed to for 40 hours. Дүчуэс тайвэн цаг хийж харуулдаг юмүүс юмсэдан харцүүшгүй өндрий юмсэг би ганц цагд ярх гадаг. And it's not only the mindset. Бэй ярхэш бүр хийх гэдаг охгүй. It's not only the mindset. Энэ зүхэн сэдгэлгээдэй албаатай бэш. It's also the relationships. Энэ чин харилцаан я асууд. In companies they have power battles. Зүхэн сэдгэлгээ юш тэдэр кампан дотор ауулулд гэл Байнгийн хүч чадлийн мүргілдөө сүргілдөө дотар емж гаш. Gossip, hidden alliances. Гэл нүүгдмал одоо тэй юмнүүд одоо бүлгілдөөд энэ тэргэл. Own private agendas. Гэл хувийн одоо аджэнда нүүд хувийн амбийг зүүд. Who gets the next promotion? Яа, эсдэй хэн дарагийн даралбан душа дэвшиг болу. Who will be the best worker of the month next month? Дэн дараа сарийн хамгийн сарийн хүнэн хэн байх болу гайлэн. Өрсэлдү and all the church members are bathing in that the whole week. Тэхээр ээ бүх сүмээ маан итэгч нэр долон онгийн тэрш ээм нүхцэл байд татар бүр үлгий дүүлж гаа охгүй. So they come to church Sunday morning. Тэгээр бүдэс айдар сүмдээр ерчин. Яа, эсдэй, юү эж, дэй, юу нас гарад дэрэй, юу рүй ахч. Hey, this is not companies, this is church. Тэхээр ээн чин компанчин лаб бишшу, ээн чин сүм шүү дэй. It becomes reflexes. Дэхээр энэ чин бүр яй эрфлекс болчаддаг ахгүй бүр. They have to protect themselves against manipulation. Дэхээр ажилд дээр болчага дарангүй лас өрштэг хамгаал хасто тэд. Now the big thing in these weeks is sexual harassment. Энэ долон хамгийн хамгийн том зүйл ол билгийн хүчирхий лэл байна. Is running like a wave over the whole globe now. Ото энэ дэлхий дээр болчага шта бүр дэлхий юртан цэр энэ чин бүр зүгээр ото хуу салгшаг ябж гоу. The Me Too movement, have you heard of that? Me Too гэдэг бүр ото хүтлэн үүссэн, бич бас гэдэг хүтлэн. Politicians, CEOs. Энэ энэ хэн оролц жэнэ. Ото тээ кампанэ захарлууд, ус түшчэд. Sport coaches who abuse the small girls. Sport энэ дасгалж үүлэг чэд үүрштэг ото доор хэчээж гоу охтүүдэг хүчэрхийлдэг. Hollywood stars, everybody loved them. Голливуд Young boy when he was fourteen. Нүгөө мондаг жүжиг чин чин тэ нэг залуг арун дүрт ахтан хүчир хэсэн бол таарж гаох гоад. People are living in that environment all the time. 
Тэгэд яг ийм нөхцөл байдал дотор тэн дотор байн амьдрдаг тэр хүмүүс. Тэгэд ийм юм дотороос гараа сүмрүү ирээ л да. Пастор мэн надад битий үрээрэ. Яасан бэ яасан бэ яа үрээрэ. Because in in that thing all the time protect themselves. Тэгэд тэгэхээр ийм юм дотор байгаа тохиолдолд өөрсдөө хамгаалах нь зүй үү гэж тийм. God's house you don't have to protect yourself. Тэгэм та бурхны өргөн дотор бол өөрийгөө хамгаалах хэрэггүй шүү. Should be like a family. Энд чинь гэр бүл чинь ахгүй. When our children come home to us, when our children they don't know. Тэгээ манай гэрт хурж ирчихэл гэж надаа хин чүтэй өөр юу аяста цаашаа цаашаа гэл ингээд даттагнаа дээр. Why do you have that knife in your hand? Та яагаад гартаа над гутгаан бариу одоо юугаан бариу гэл. Cutting the meat. Би зөв махаал отлох жишээ шүү. Өөр яасан би. I'm not a terrorist, I'm not a jihadist. Би террорист биш, jihadist ч биш дөхөө энэ төрлөөс чиглэл. Тэгэхээр сүм дотор тэгж олохгүй л гэж ахгүй юм. So we are bad in that. That's why we must become kingdom people. Ийм амар нөхцөл байдал дотор бид нэр 7 өнгийн их хөдрөг өнгөрөж байгаа учраас бид нэр хаанчлын итгэлээр болох хэвээр. And stay kingdom people the whole week. Тэгээд 7 хоногийн турш хаанчлын хүн хэвээрэ бай. That's why we want to raise you as a breakthrough believer. Чухам энэ л зорилгын төлөө та нарыг бид нэр ялгуулсан итгэлч болохгүй л ажиллаад байгаа юм шиг. So through the week you can keep this to keep the level. Тэгснээрээ та 7 онгийн турш ямар төвшөнд очсон байсан тэрийг хадгалах байхгүй юу? Even you are bathed in Babylonian environment. Та Бабилоны систем дотор бүр ингээд одоо байж байсан ч. Hostile to God environment. Бурхныг дайсгандаг тэр өөр амьсгал дотор байж байсан. Clear and the salt clear clean as well. Та бүр яг гэрэл шиг э бүр яг давс шиг э бүр цэвэр одоо тодорхой байх хэрэгтэй байхгүй otherwise every sunday morning we have бүтэн сайдрын өглөө болгон бид нар таник fearful sheep coming to the house гэр тоо тэ манай одоо сүмд орж ирж байгаа айцсан ухаан алтаад ундагч байгаа хоник бид нар үлдэж байгаа юм хил ю wash you хэрэгтэй угаах хэрэгтэй одоо яах вэ тэвэр хэрэгтэй нөө нөө хаг нөө хаг нөө хаг мэдэж байгаа бид бид тэвэр бид тэвэр гэж нөөдгөр айц очсоо байгаа өрөө sexual harassment Бидгийг гүчрэхэд л хол байна надаас хол бай гэл. Just relax. I'm Гүйг уч тааш. I'm your spiritual father. Тааш би ч нэг сүнсний эцэг юм. Хэнжээн үгүй үгүй тааш бас пастор штэ хаж угаарна гэл. Ингээл бүр юм юм болцсон. That's why we build the way we build. Тэгэхээр бид нар дин ту эн зорилгын төлөө ажилт юм а барьд юм а. So you don't go down every Monday. We have to raise your hands. Бүтэн сайдар босч ол бүр нэвт хөдрөн буцаж унаад байхгүй тул. Daniel in Babylon. He kept that thing strong. Babylon дамдржсэн Даниел ол үнэндээ л хүчтэй байсан. He maintained the level. Тэр өөрөө төвшөнгөө хадгалдаг байсан баггүй. This is what we go for. Яг л энэний төлөө бид нар яваа. It's not impossible. Энэ боломжгүй биш. It is possible. Энэ үнэхээр боломжтой. We need some insight. Ганцхан бидэнд гүн ойлгох хэрэгтэй. We need to cry out to God, create in me a clean heart, O God. Тэгээд бурхан лоо хашгирах хэрэгтэй байна. Бурхан миний цэвэр зүрхийг бүтээгээч. Don't cast me out of your presence. Өөрөө ашгуугаас намайг битэй хөөгөөч. Don't take the Holy Spirit away from me. Битэй ариун сүнсээ надаас аваач. Refine me all the time. Намайг үргэлж ингэж одоо бүр цэвэршүүлээч. Break bones and restore bones. Та яс юм нь хуглаач тэгээ буцаага боогоч. Amen. So the kingdom. That's why we speak about the kingdom. Тэгэл бид нар хаанчлын яриад идэг байхгүй үү те. Because the kingdom is so powerful. Учир нь хаанчлал өөрөө хүчрэхэг юм. That's why I've written these small books about the kingdom. Тэм учраас би та нарт одоо өгсөн байгаа жижиг хэн номнууд хаанчлын. Everybody speak about this. Speak about the kingdom. Өнөөдөр бүх хүн хаанчлын тухай ярьж. And when I speak with them and ask them questions, they don't know what they're talking about. Тэ яриад байгаа хүмүүсээс нь за тэр чинь юу юм бэ гэхээр хариулч чадахгүй. For most Christians the kingdom is just doing Christian things. Олон христчтэй хувьд хаанчлал бол зүгээр христ чин үйлдэл хийх. It's not the kingdom is the kingdom. Хаанчлал бол хаанчлал. It's a kingdom. Энэ чин хаанчлал. There is government, there is order. Энэ чин засгийн газар, энэ чин эмэг цэгт. There is finances. Энэ чин чин санхүү. Amen. It's a kingdom. Энэ чин хаанчлал бүхэл үйлдэл. There is minister of finances. Энэ чин чин санхүү, санхийн сайд гэж байна. Энэ чин чин боловсрал гэж байна. Amen. It's a kingdom. Хаанчлал Then we, as we understand the kingdom, then we will understand church. We will understand worship. We will understand evangelism. Bit nor hand to hand, just the guys who come. Bit nor sumi guys who come. Bit nor machtal hundred the guys who come. Bit nor awarding zari guys who come. Yeah, that's why I wrote this. Four number five is on the way about the kingdom. Тийм учраас би хаанчлын тухай дөрөн жижиг ном бицаад тавхан удахгүй гарч ирэв. Give my contribution to a better understanding of what is it. Хаанчлал нь юу юм бэ гэдгийг илүү сайн ойлгосон байхад миний оруулж байгаа хувь нэмэр. If you ask when I ask people, you know, in if I ask people. 
хэрэв та хүмүүсээс асуу бол what was what happened what has happened in your church the last month өнгөрсөн сар танаас өндөр юу болсон бэ гэд асуу бол well yeah let's see what happened яала нэрэ yeah we spoke oh. about юу яас юм байх вэ jesus jesus тэр га ярьсан юм байна you say that you never go wrong you know ингээ хэлцэн байхад та уруу тухай шүү дээ hopefully you spoke about jesus jesus тэр га ярьсан байгаа сайл гэж одоо найдах юм да the next the next answer is за дараагийн the kingdom you know асуулт надад хаанчлаа юм да spread the if you if you just ask them what what is it та зүгээр те хаанчл гэж юу юм бэ гэж асууч байна you be you will be surprised та бол өндөл цочртонд I don't blame them because I didn't know either яад гэд би тэднэрэг нэх буруутгаад байгаа ч юм биш яад гэд би ч мэдээгүй л байлаа for me it was like prayer worship миний үед бол хаанчлын гудад аврлын зар илгээл тод үгүй энэ бүгдээрээ христчин програм хөтөлбөр 3 steps back тэгэхээр гурван ухраад then kingdom самбра арчаад and then in that light тэгээ яг тэр хаанчлын гэрэл дотор define worship define prayer магтаал хүндлэлийг тодорхойл because all that is not wrong учир нь тэр христчин хөтөлбөр чинь буруу биш байхгүй юу буруу гэдэг байгаа юм биш so number 2 was is хоёрдхан the kingdom and the covenant хаанчлалба гэрээ байла so underline that in your life за тий амьдралтай энийг нэг сайхан тодруулаад авчаарай what is this inheritance хүмүүс people ask you when people ask you тий хүмүүс тий танаас асуу штэ энэ өв гэж яг юу юм бэ maybe they saw you in the seminar тий seminar та таныг харсан юм а энэ яг юу юм бэ өв гэж sit down two minutes i will tell you за сууч 2 минут нь би хэлж байгаа number one нэгдвэрт инсайт гигэрэл одоо юу гүн ойлголт all of us we are so hungry for understanding бид нар сэ үнэхээр ойлголтоор өсч байна you know what you wish most people will say их их хүмүүс hey me too that is another one me too me too so new hashtag they will say yeah те их их хүмүүс бас л яна би ч гэсэн яг үн шүү дээ би ч гэсэн амар өсөөд байна you know um гих баг. The person I met in another country. Би нэг өөр улсад нэг үнтэй уулзчих гэсэн. After listening to me she said to me teach me how to read the bible. Тэ надтай ярилцч чад тэр юмтэй хэлжээс библ яаж уушихыг зааж өгөөч гэж. She been a Christian for years. Her parents are Christian. Жилэр хэрэс христчин гэр бүл төрсөн. But suddenly she realized. Гинэт ухаарч байгаа хөөх. I don't read I don't read I, I don't know how to read the bible. Би чи юурсэ библ уншиж мэддэг юм бэ? No the bible is a very different book. It's not a book at all. Библ бол ер нь бол ном биш шүү дээ. It's so different. You cannot read the bible. It's so different. Хэрэв та унших юм бол нэг их өөр байхгүй гэж. Жирийн ном биш. Yeah. Okay, the kingdom. The covenant is very important. Тэгээд араад нэлэхгүй юу? Гэрээ, гэрээ айгуу чухал шүү дээ. Гэтэл одоо хүн асуу бол. Oh my. I spoke about that I think once. би нэг удаа тий гэрээний тухай ярьжсэн шээ. But I believe that's part of the inheritance we have. Тэгэхээр гэрээ гэдэг бол бидэнд ирэх өвийн нэг хэсэг гэж боддог. As Christians Христчин гүдийн хувьд we have a tendency. Христчин гэдэг утгаараа бид нарт I don't have time to explain why we have it. We have it. Бид нарт нэг ийм зүйл байдаг. We have хамтлаг. A, a, a chronic chronic how do you say chronic like like a chronic sickness, sickness? Uh-huh. Yeah, uh-huh. Chronic? Uh-huh. Yeah. we have a chronic tendency mm-hmm. to fall into all kinds chronic ч нөгөө архаг тий архаг өвчин гэлээ гэдэг шиг бид нарт бүр нэг тийм архагшсан хандлага байна л да одоо ойлголтод ч юм уу тий it's in me it's in me as well тий the beach гэсэн бас тийм байсан i have that tendency би бас яг тийм байсан i believe we all have that бид нарт бүгдэрэнд байна ямар нэгэн зүйл хандддаг тийм that's why the new government we have to really hold it Тэгэхээр бид нар шин гэрээнээсээ үнэхээр зуурх ёстой юм аа. We have a tendency to perform. Бид нар ингээ юм үзүүлэх одоо хандлагатай байдаг тийм харуулах. If our spiritual life goes down. Бид нарын сүнсний амьдралд оршлоо одоо унлаа. Instead of fixing it. Аа тэрийг засгийн орнод. We cover it. Бид нар зүгээр нэг бүтээлгээр гуччдаг. 
if we have problems instead of running to him or running to our spiritual fathers say, I will pray double so many hours. What is that? In Old covenant. Is deeds. Deeds cannot, deeds cannot produce life. Life must produce deeds. Otherwise, the Bible has a label for that. It's called dead works. It's dead works. Just dead works. I know sometimes we need to show self-discipline. Even we don't feel anything, we raise our hand and we worship him. It's okay. Self-discipline is okay. But self-discipline must come from a good heart. God I feel sad, I don't feel anything. But I have to tell you, I, I love you anyway. But what I'm saying? I love you, I will always love you. I will always love you. I have five questions you have not answered me yet, but I still love you. <laughs> I want a better job. I'm still in the old bad job, but I will still honor you and love you and follow you. That's the right heart. I mean, but to do things to Show him certain things. I will pray more. I will pastor Suda, I will listen to your last message fifteen times. Don't. I mean not with that heart. You can do that with the right heart. You know, certain people in our church, we ask them not to read the Bible. Can you imagine that? There's so much legalism. So much law. So we had to tell them the opposite at what we should tell them. Why? Because every time they open the Bible, they feel con they feel condemned. They read, you know, uh, don't be angry at your brother. Oh. I was angry at my daughter yesterday. Yana, oh, oh, my Then don't read the Bible. Because Rejoice always in the law. Oh my goodness. <gasps> when did I rejoice the last time? <laughs> I cannot even remember. <laughs> Everything in the Bible condemns. Because you are an old covenant person. He Fulfill the law. Live with him. Walk with him. Worship him. Take his word seriously. As you do that, even without thinking, you will do well. You will fulfill the law because he fulfilled the law. When you don't and step aside, Immediately, the Spirit tells you, hey, come back to track. You go this way. Hey, come back to track. Okay, okay, okay. That's the new covenant. And, and if we come to him and ask for forgiveness for our sin, he is righteous. He will forgive our sin and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. What a life. You know, so we told that lady, don't read the Bible. 
And to the rest of the church, read the Bible. That's the, that's the, the sad that person, I cannot even talk with that person. I said to her, don't talk with me anymore. Because everything I say becomes a problem. Somehow, my wife has a special grace to say sharp things people don't discover they are bleeding. <laughs> they just have bleeding. I say half a thing they feel pain already. So certain people go to my wife. Others, I can talk with them. Look them in the eye and say, don't do that again. And then, no problem. Because if you live in the new covenant, you have a good father. You're a child of God. Amen. 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 This is so Liberating. That's why the new covenant is better than the old. So number two was the kingdom and the covenant. Can we take one more? Okay. Next one. Number three. Um, pure, how, uh, let me read a verse, then you will understand. Second Corinthians, chapter 11. From verse 1. I wish you would bear with me in a little foolishness. Do, do bear with me. So Paul is about to say something. And he had the impression that they might not like it. But he was a good father for the Corinthians. So do bear with me, I have to say this. For I feel a divine jealousy for you. Since I betrothed you to one husband to present you as a pure virgin to Christ. Then he comes, verse 3. I am afraid. That as the serpent deceived Eve by his cunning, your thoughts will be led astray from a sincere and pure devotion to Christ. So I call point the key number three. A sincere and pure devotion to Christ. This church was a good church. Paul said, "You are rich." In all things. But he said, I am afraid that you are moved away from a sincere and pure devotion to Christ. Christ I believe this is a part of our inheritance. In, in, our, in our churches, in this network, Isaac network, this is one thing which is everywhere all the time. Not perfect. But we value it and we pursue it. So the first point is the kingdom. 
Stay simple. Ingin ba? It's devotion to Christ. Simple. Christ the door of Zarul Chaga Zarul is not a ingin ba. It's like love between two persons. In yari sa kahir kuni kahir shikste. Can be a deep friendship or it can be marriage. Can be yeah. Ти зүгээр хүмүүсийн хоорондын гүн нөхөрлөл байж болно. Эсвэл одоо эрэхтэй эмхтэй хоёр хүний одоо хайр байж болно. Гэр бүл их нэр нөхрийн. It must be pure and simple. Ямар ч гэсэн цэвэр байх хэвээр. Тэгээ бас энгийн байх хэвээр. Good friendships are very simple. Тэгээд одоо маш сайн найз нөхдийн холбоо чинь айгүй энгийн байдаг шүү дээ. Good friends they pick up the phone and call each other. Сайн найзууд чинь тийм төвгөө биш шүү дээ. Шууд утсаа аваад яриад яаж юм чи юм нэг л ярддаг шүү дээ. They're not thinking oh let me see maybe I should ask. Ah, it's bad. his parents to check out if he's okay if i can тэр зүгээр байгааг эцэг ихээс нь уцтаж эхлээд асуу я дараа нь тэр нь лөө утас яа friends just drop in үгүй штэ найз тэгдгүү байж зүгээр шууд өсөрч басаал knock knock are you home хаалгаа тогшоол хаалган тогшоол айл гэртээ байна уу чи гэл shout through the mail thing you know тэр ингээл тэр хаалганыхан доогоор шагааж магаагаал ингээл are you depressed чи яас дарамтанд орцсон байна уу can i come in би орж болох уу тэгэхээр сайн найзууд зүгээр л ороод ирдэг and you don't kick them out. Та өшгөлж гаргадгүй. Even you maybe that's the last thing you wish happened that day. Тэ та бүр эсвэл битэ ирээсэ гэж бодсон байсан ч гэсэн та хөөж гаргадгүй шүү дээ тэр өдөр. You are not like that. Okay. Та тийхгүй. I am like that. Тэ би л аа тийм биш. Some when I hear the doorbell I'm thinking oh no. Тэ зарымдаа ингээ хон хаалганы онх дуурахаар би яана гэдэг л дээ. God not na. Бурхан миний яг одоо биш ээ одоо айгүй хүнтэй уулзмаргүй байгаа хөөхгүй та тийм. Телефон who is calling me. Тэгэл хин над руу утас дуугарын шүү дээ. Уцчих байгаа хүнийг харал яана яг одоо л энэ дээр мэр. Mute. Mute дээр нь тавьчихт юм уу чи юм уу дээр нэ. I don't have the shaking thing. Над руу нөө юу байхгүй. Vibrator байхгүй. Миний утсанд vibrator байх. You don't have this like that. I have this like that. Миний хоолгоо тийм байхгүй. Sometimes my wife comes home. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Зарим дэ манай ихнэр гэрт хүрж ирэх. Хүүе нэг юм их юм арччих. Some friends are coming in 10 minutes. Тэ 10 минутын дараа нэг хэдэн үе ирэх шүү манай найзууд гэсэн. I'm out of here. Тэнгүүд би ш дээ. Ёо. Болё болё би гарлаа энэ дэс. You don't have this like you don't know what I'm talking about. You know. Тэр би бол ер нь тийм төрлийн хэл гэдэг байна л да. But friends any time. Тэр ер нь найзууд гэдэг бол хизээ л хизээ штэ тэдэнд нэг тийм төвхтэй биш. Тий тийм дон тийм дон гэж орол. Тэгэл та тэ зүг харж энэгэл буруу харж уйлаад угтдаг ис тэ. I go to see you. Ёо чамаг харсан да баярлаад байна. I'm disturbing you. Yes you are. Яна чамаг сада болцсон уу харин тэ сада болцсон. Тэгтээ яах вэ? That's friends. Тэгвэл чи найзууд байхгүй юу та зүгээр зүгээр Are you, are you here? Үрэ хэлцэн чад өнгөрө хот дээ. I'm not okay, but you are welcome. Тэгээ жоохон тийм л байх нэг хэвчээ цөр цөр. Let's talk and let's have a good time together. Ярилцсан идэ ууй гэл. That's simple. Тэгэхээр энгийн л дээ энэ бүхэн бол энгийн махгүй юу? Keep it simple. Keep church simple. Сүмд ч гэсэн юм энгийн байж сурач. Keep worship simple. Keep prayer simple. Махгүй таа энгийн залбирах таа энгийн гэдэг ч одоо энгийн махгүй юу? Amen. That's why in our church for a while we didn't have prayer meetings. We stopped them. Because prayers have become so complicated. I found out that's why people didn't dare to pray loud because they were ashamed of their, you know, bad prayers or weak prayers. Who must sing it now? They, I go. чанга дугуур залбирхаасаа ичтэг те хилж байгаа үгнээсээ санаа зовдог юу яарч залбирхаа мэддэг үү тэрэндээ бүр тэгэлцэрсэн тийм байгааг би олж харсан баг. I cannot pray like him. Би тэр шиг залбирч. Of course not. You should not. Тэр чадахгүй бүр чадахгүй ч байх ёстой. He is he you you. Тэр чинь тэр чи чинь чи юм байгаа. Yeah, but these prayers. Би тэгтэл тэрний залбирал. You know our children when they come home they don't say you know daddy I cannot talk with you because I cannot talk the way he talks. Тэнгэрт зүгээр шууд асуудал руугаа л орой л доо. Тойроо л ингээд. I shouldn't come home they don't have formulas like that. Тийм ээ хүүхдүүд гэр орондоо ирэхдээ тэг хэрэггүй байдаг юм шүү дээ. Hi daddy I'm hungry. Аа вау сайн аа тур чүглээ тухлын ашаа мөргөлөө гэдэг. Make a cup of tea for me. 
You can make it yourself. And when you make it for yourself, you make one for daddy too. It's called, it's called payback time. But we still sing. Oh, you're going good, Father. When you, when you talk with him. Oh God of heaven, creator of the universe. Let the universe be. It, work, it works very well without you. Let God. You don't say that to your father, to your mother. But if you pray like that, and you sing in church, you are a good, good father, you have a double life. Та тэгэд залбирч чадвал заяа тэнгэрт байгаа гэд. Тэгээд бас сүм дотор та бол сайн сайн эцэг гэж үүр утгаар нь дуул чадвал. За энэ бол ёстой давхар амьдрал бол биш. А биш шүүдтэр бисэн солирч өгч. Хараа та та бол сайн сайн эцэг гэж дуулчаад өөр амьдралаар амьдруул энэ чи хоёр нүртэй байна гэсэн үг гэж байгаа юм байна. Энэ бол эрүүл биш. If you had in a meeting worship then prayer. Махтаал, залбирал and then you sing to a good, good father. And then I say, Mono, you pray now. And he comes with all the formulas. Of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Mono, sit down, stop. <laughs> because I saw you sing, you are a good, good father. But then when you talk with him, you talk like to a dictator. Or... You understand? That's a double tongue. It's not okay. Purity, pure, simple devotion Christ. to Christ. Of course, we have respect for him. Yeah. Of course, we speak in a decent way with him, not like a body. Yeah, we speak with respect. But we, res- we speak with respect to our parents. We don't say, you know, hey, no. Hi, daddy. Yeah, we have respect. But we still still our father. Pure and simple devotion to Christ. Christ He is the chief cornerstone. And I believe that the father pay attention, pays attention mm-hmm. to how we relate to Christ. Because Christ is his son. In the same way, if I bring my children here, I will pay attention to how you treat them because they are my kids. Uh-huh. It's normal. If somebody, if you go to pick up your children at school, and you, can, and you see a teacher or other students treat them badly, you will intervene. You will say, hey, hey, hey. you and I, we must meet soon. What about in five minutes? Don't talk to my children. Yeah, but they are, they are so slow and they are stupid. Don't talk to them. Even they are slow and stupid or rebellious or whatever. Don't talk to them like that. That's my kids. The father. Attention. How our simple devotion to Christ is His Son. His only begotten Son He gave for us. That's why let finish with this. I think I've mentioned it before. Not in this context. 
Basically, there is nothing new in all this. But I have collected different bits of the puzzle and brought them together to show you this is inheritance. God protected. Because it's powerful. John 14, 23. And we'll... John 14, 23. Six minutes, then I'm done. Yoch Arun Durwyn. Yoch Arun 14:23. Jesus answered him, "If anyone loves me, he will keep my word. And my Father will love him, and we will come to him and make our home with him." Oh, very interesting. I love it. So if anyone loves me, very simple. Love is simple. Love is not complicated. So Jesus asked Peter, do you love me? Blah, 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 blah. Do you love me? Blah, 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 blah. So then, do you love me? Yes, I do. Okay. Now I got it. Simple and pure. So if anyone loves me, he will keep my word. Keeping has to do with time. So I am the disciple. I love Jesus. Because I love him. I listen to him. What he says, I keep it. Over time, I keep it. I can have good circumstances, I can have bad ones. But I keep what he said. So Jesus said, if you love me, you keep what I said. And then he said, and my father will love him. Because we, keep, we love his son and we keep the words of the song. Whoa. So I believe the father looks at us at our lives how much we love his son. Because if we don't love him, if we don't honor him, if we don't listen to his voice and align to what he says, then the father will Okay, something has to happen here. <laughs> because the father loves his son. Doesn't mean Mary, if somebody criticizes my wife, I will find, I will find the person. Yeah. I had to do that. In our previous church, and I, had, and I had to do something radical about it. Some were her. And it was so deceitful that she did not see it. I saw it. And Sometimes it will cheat me. My wife sees. Sometimes people cheat. Me. But she sees. Because we cannot, we can, we cannot live 360 degrees. You know what I'm saying? Even there is something called 360 degrees management. I don't know what it is. We cannot live like that. That's why we need to destiny companions. We walk together. That's why we need destiny companions. We walk together. That's why we need destiny companions. We walk together. They can watch my back. 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 They can wat
So pure and simple devotion to Christ. Christ it, it will bless your life. The Father will love it. And Jesus said a very strange thing. He said, My Father and I, we will come and make our home with you. Yeah, I thought Jesus lived in my heart. He does. But he speaks about something else. He speaks about assignment. So if you walk and love the son, his word, you qualify for partnership. Then the father and the son will come and talk about what God wants to use you for. Use you for. So please keep clean, keep simple. Amen. In church, stay simple. Oh, Pastor Philip, I don't know how to greet you. Oh, so Pastor Philip, because you, you know, you, Pastor Philip, and Pastor Philip. What about doing like this? And shake my hand. That could be a way. <laughs> what do you think about that? Can, can I really do that? Yeah, let, let me see. Practice a little bit. Second time. Third time. Fourth time. Fifth time. No, can do that. Now, try with me then. I mean, you, I hear things like that in church. It's unbelievable. Keep simple and clean. Amen. 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 Good. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Thank you, Sue. Welcome. Tomorrow, same time, same place.